Okay. I'm going to look at Arena today. Exclusively the matchmaking queue. Let's see here. Um, I don't really need to be here. I need to go into the personal matchmaking. Let's see how this goes. Actually, before I do that, I remember yesterday I got in this weapon. No, not this weapon. This weapon I have equipped, which is quality level 55. So I should actually go ahead and equip them or enhance it first before using it. Because my other one I enhanced to plus one. And then I immediately dumped away because the tutorial told me to. Well, now for this new one that you told me to get, I might as well get it to plus one as well. There's no reason not to, right? Then I'm actually in the district of Chang'an right now, and I need to find a blacksmith. But I don't. S oh, here it is. Here's one. Also, rebound my hockeys yesterday. I have to get used to the new hockeys as well. Three and four are my CCs. Two is a CC. Wait, I uh, fuck. I already went the wrong way to the blacksmith. This fucking wall. Two is a CC. E is. I put E as like a root. I don't actually know how E works. And R is my interrupt. E is my slow. V, I still don't really know how this works. C is remove CC. And I think I have every skill, right? Like, that's every skill. Blowing in the wind? And yeah, that's... Wait, what is this? Wait, that's a stodge, right? No, that's a stodge. That's, that's not a skill. That's a stodge. Um, interrupt I have, run away, this I have, running. Alright, I have this at 6, not really sure what the use is. This guy I don't even know how to use. I've done the F6. I notice you can't actually use rapid healing in, in a def battle or in a fight. I don't know if that shot F4 actually makes any sense. This one I have, okay, so yeah, I think I have every skill used. I don't know what this does. Oh, and the only th other thing is I need to do my glyphs. I never did this. I should actually probably read up what these glyphs actually do, or the glyphs, glyphs, I don't know. But first, let me enhance. I have 16, it only takes one. And it only goes up to plus one too, so I don't really need to worry about that. Like, this is all maxed now, so I'm good here. Oh, I can actually sock it. Should I sock it? How do I sock it? Actually, before I sock it, do I even have anything to sock it in there? Um, This is for companion. Let me just get rid of this. This is res recipe. Um, complete a quest. Okay, I don't, I don't really need that. This is what collectible, not that. Another collectible, not that. Um, look, this is crafting material. I'm guessing. Another collectible. Uh, another collectible. This is like my PVE equipment. Another collectible. Damn, so many, so many collectibles. Oh, here's my jade. Okay, so physical strength, sprint, or mastery. Well, that's actually a good question because I don't know what mastery does. 
Mastery increases my damage skill specifically. Like, I'm mostly DPSing with Cloud Ripple. And my Phantoms. So that's what it increases. These two specific skills. But is that better than going for physical attack directly? I don't know how it scales. And then I also have the option of Sprint, which is uh, reduce skill cooldown. Honestly, reducing skill cooldowns also seems really OP. But by 33% or 33% is what I have it right now. Hmm. So I have the ability to increase, to reduce my cooldown. Or I can increase the damage, or I can just go straight physical attack. I actually don't really know. I mean, I guess let's just go for damage for now. Maybe we'll learn more later about how everything works. So how do I sock it? Like, do I just... That's not it. Huh. I guess that's the next challenge. Now that I have the thing I want to socket, how do I socket it? But it's not the blacksmith. What else might it be? Armor merchant, weapon stealer? Probably not. Workbench? It could be the workbench. Wouldn't be surprised. That's not what I was expecting. Oh, this is for crafting gear. Huh. There's actually a crafting system for gear as well. But it's not just dungeon gear. But these gears are... really bad? I'm assuming you have to unlock them, right? And here you can- oh wait, you can actually combine... Like these... Level 1 Jades into level 2 Jades. Okay, so that's one thing to note. And I'm assuming you have to like craft some of these lower level gear to get access to the... Higher grade gear, probably. This is called the Qianquan Bag. Yeah. Because otherwise, there's no reason to craft them, but that must be it. So that's how I combine sockets. But... How do I socket the things I already have? Uh, I better not be hidden in a window. Does, does it say material you for a normal socket can be possessed if socketed? Can be inserted into sockets. No effects when I can't do anything when I right click them. Can be unequipped. Nope, more info. Yeah, I can socket it. Oh, I can only socket level 1 anyways. On these set of gears. Uh, I'm assuming I have to go to an NPC that lets me socket, right? Otherwise, this whole thing just makes no sense. So if it's not the workbench, what might it be? Probably... Uh, I mean, I doubt it's the merchant, but I don't really have anything else to go by. But I just feel like Merchant would be selling me here. Not really for me to socket my current gear. It would be for selling new gears. And the Blacksmith already isn't really helpful. 
There's no other NPCs here. All right, let me just take a look. Yeah, that's not it. A respawn point. Oh, I never got this one. Oh, it's not like... It's not like I'll die in a town. Oops. Not really worried. Let's just get the EXP, might as well. I'm actually level cap too. Student 1 is the highest level. So in fact, I, there isn't a higher level after Student 1. That's really surprising. So here's the armor merchant. And again, that's not it. So what else am I missing? How do I sock it? Like, what could it possibly be? If it's not a workbench, and it's not a blacksmith. Like, is there, a, is there an interface setting? Wouldn't be surprised. Skills, ancestral innocence. Nope, that's not it. Fitting device? The heck is this? Oh, this is like... Like how games have like the calculators. But here, it's just built into the game itself. You don't need an external website to do it for you. You know, that's actually pretty convenient. If that If that's how this is. Except I don't actually see where it says the stats. <laughs> the whole point is to like... Yeah, where does it say what... Okay, whatever. But I'm assuming that's what it's for. Like you can see what all the gears the game has. And then through that... You can decide what build you want to go for next. It's like a calculator built into the game itself. Always a nice feature, though. But it's not that the game lacks feature, it's that it does such a terrible job of explaining how any feature works. Like, usually, you would expect one of the main NPCs to do it. Like on uh, BDO, if you want a socket, you just go to the Black Spirit and it just does the socket, which is where everything is. Like enhancement, socketing, it's all there. On Perfect World, there every NPC, like every merchant NPC can also socket. On Swordsman, you just drag it into the thing directly. But in this game, like what's going on? How can it be how can it possibly be so difficult to figure out? You know what? I'm gonna go to Cloud Rise. I know every NPC is in Cloud Rise. So if anything, it will probably be there. This way not only can I travel faster, because I'm not forced to travel by foot. Even though I have a flying sword, but I also uh, will know that it won't be like one of the NPC that subsects us to Cloud Rise. Potentially. Because every NPC is here, so we can just talk to all of them. Is 
That guy looks pretty cool. I've never noticed this guy like that before. Alright, here's the map. So it can't be that. Merchants. Um yeah, here's where you like exchange various currencies. Yeah, like these are a bunch of events where you exchange currencies. This is what, like for uh, making a guild. Yeah, this is for making a guild. And what is that sound in the background? What is making that noise? Bro, I do not know what's making that noise. <laughs> okay. Okay, that's my mailbox. None of this so far. The inventory manager, so I can... Oh, shit. I definitely threw away a few of these. But these can actually be used to expand your storage as well. Okay, that's good to know. You should probably keep them if you have extras. Yeah, I think I threw away like one of these bags that gave us plus six slot. Because I thought it would be useless after having uh, all of my inventory expansion used up here. But no, you can actually put like nine. Wait, like eight. Like eight of them in here. What else? I don't I wanna put away my crafting materials, right? Like there's some like these ones. Uh that's for crafting. Like this is for crafting. This is for crafting. 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 Uh okay, so I can put these away. Now then. But that's not what I'm looking for. I'm still trying to figure out where I can go ahead and socket the things into my gear. Socketing. Hey, this is just to make like better the next tier. But it's not to go ahead and actually socket it in. But that ain't it. Armorer? Nope, that's for selling. That's, uh, th or just back again to this guy. Bro, we saw every NPC. How can it be so difficult to. Like, how can it be so difficult to socket it? Hold shift and left click? I did not notice that. I, I just saw that text. Oh my god. Damn. Why am I so bad at PvE? Hold shift and left click to open the socketing thing. Holy fuck. Or hold shift and right click. Yeah, whatever. Fuck it. Holy fuck. Alright, and I have... Uh, some of these things. Might as well put these ones in as well. Also, interesting, this one can only be red or green. And, or, and not blue. So I guess that was actually a good idea. That I didn't get all greens. Or all blues. I got some red, red ones as well. But then, I mean, maybe I do want a blue one in here. Who knows? Okay, so we got socketing done. Now, the next thing we need to do 
is what? That's everything, right? I think that's all I needed to do. So let's just go ahead and go into the doors now. And see what we get. Damn, why is the queue so long all of a sudden? It was so fast yesterday. So what do we have? Like this is... The top layer. Oh no, wait. I forgot. Glyphs. Glyphs. That was the other thing I needed to do. So we have... Like, three... Like, why are these not activated? Or like, what does this mean? Like, I can choose these ones or this one. But not that one? Huh? Wait, I can, but I can only choose four. Wait, but why can, I, why can I only choose four if there's, like, six slots? That's weird. But this one cancels zero points. And then some of these are recommended. So like this one, when deducting damage, after using the charged Cloud Ripper, the consumed strikes are treated as the ones actually consumed plus 10. Oh my god, what is this saying? Let's see. When deducting damage, after using the charged Cloud Ripper. So when calculating damage after char charging Cloud Ripper, The consumed strikes are treated as the ones actually consumed the plus 10. So basically, it's a free plus 10 strikes on damage calculation. I think that's what it means. So even if you have 0, it's plus 10, and if you have 100, it's 110. Like, it's always treated as if you have 10 more. I think that's what it means. Okay. Dense Forest, after recharging Cloud Ripper, you will receive three stacks of the Dense Forest effect, which can accelerate the following three Wind Cleaver. Uh, okay. So after using Cloud Ripper, you get a buff called Dense Forest, during which your next three wind cleaver attack is faster. I think that's what it means. Alright, in the wind breaker state. Actually, let's look at this. Cloud riding. Increase the automatic regeneration of edge. That's actually nice, but... I'm still not sure why I need edge. Like, most of my skills don't use Edge. Only this skill uses Edge. So I'm not sure. Like, I guess I'll use it. Recommending it. And next we have... While recharging Cloud Dripper, the number of teleports you can perform. Okay, so that's like... The dash I can do. The movement speed is increased by 30% after casting Blowing in the Wind. What's Blowing in the Wind? Am I missing something? Oh, this skill. Oh, so, so okay, so dodge. Okay, so after dodging, they have 30% movement speed. And then the next wind cleaver can move eight meters forward. Wait, what? That good? How does that even work? So like that? Oh, wait. That's actually 
pretty good. If I like, I can dot dash into someone and use that to the gap close. I also already have this as the gap closer. Soaring up. If HP falls below 30%, movement speed increases by 50%. And grants immunity. Okay. I mean, that's good, but... Mm, also not really. But so, it basically lasts for 5 seconds as soon as it falls below 30%. And so it's not like something you can use at will. It's just something that passively happens. So maybe you don't necessarily want that at that moment. Like, because it's really DPSing you down. Dark Forest, Slaying Grass, Swaying Grass. Recharges two stacks of Overlord. Recharges two stacks of Overlord? What does that mean? Overlord is this skill. I guess it gives five, two more stacks on top of the five that it gives. Reduces the time to charge to 30 seconds. Wait, what? What is So like if I use this and I use this, what happens? It reduces it to 30 second cooldown? Wait, it goes from 2 minutes to 30 seconds. Is that really good? And after a fully executed strike, each stack received increases it like I get 10 more seconds off Overlord. Wait, is that actually, is this really good though? Alright, well, let's see. I'm already in the fight. I guess it is time. To do an actual battle. Oh wait, look. Everyone here are real player. Because they actually have, like, PvP, PvP gear. Wait, so yesterday it was all bots then. These are all bots, or... Everyone got PvE gear from doing the same thing? I, I don't really get it. Because the thing yesterday was everyone had PvE gear. Instead of PvP gear. But they also had real player names. So, could it be like... The game... Have bots that copies names of real players? That would be pretty confusing, if that's the case. But I guess let's uh, let's see, because these these guys are behaving like real players for sure right now. That's a DPS, I guess. I guess I can just keep DPSing this guy. Damn, I just DPSed him down. Block? Oh, he can be immune. That's like an immunity skill. Now what? Do I just finish him off? Damn, he can just keep being immune. What? What if I just chase him down like that? Wait, why was he immune there? Okay, well, somehow I killed him. Okay, these guys definitely behave way more like real players than yesterday. Collect rewards. How do I collect them? Can I just get them automatically? Wait, did I get my reward? What? I mean, I'll queue again. But it said there, I, it said collect reward and I don't see anything. I guess I'm, I'm just missing something again.
What the heck is going on? Yeah, I did not see any reward. Actually, I got dual seals. Wait, you can only receive 2,600 per week? What? So if you're limited to 2,600 per week, I guess you can't really progress just by PvPing then. It's like Elyon. You have a limited amount that you can do per week. And if you go and if you go beyond that, you just have to uh gear up by PvE. Wait, but that doesn't make sense though. Because you can't get PvP gear by PvE. So this makes even less sense than Elyon. Like I guess Elyon kind of like forces you to do some PvE Because if you only do PvP you don't get gear. But in this game. What do you do after you, like, max out your weekly, uh, quota? You can't PvE for gear, because that's PvE gear, not PvP gear. Hmm, that's really weird. I guess we'll have to figure out what happens. So this time, hmm. What is the play this time? I don't know what any of these classes are. So we have a Berserker and the Spell Sword. And the Spearmaster. So aren't these all DPS classes? Like, like why, do, why do some people go up first? Like, is this a play? <laughs> What's the, is there a benefit to being up here? I guess we just immediately kill this guy? Wait, what's, why is he not taking any damage? And then his teammate didn't help him at all. What was that about? They just inted. I'm CC'd. I'm trying to, I guess I'm trying to like... Am I doing damage? What is going on? What? Wait, what is going on? What is going on? Wait, and, and I think... Okay. Why does it feel like sometimes when I try to CC them? Like, sometimes it feels like they're actually not taking any damage. Like, that was super weird. It felt like I couldn't tell if I was actually dealing damage to them or not. Is that just because, like, the damage numbers are so small and inconspicuous that it's hard to see? Or do they have some sort of immunity that prevents them from taking damage from time to time? I couldn't- I really couldn't tell what that was about. And I don't get this though, either. I approach the target and deal damage, but it has an effect of unconsciousness of two seconds. So then why is it sometimes when I use this, like, nothing happens to them? Like, how does CC actually work, though? Yeah, 3v3. Hey, Sasu. This is the- this is, like, what you get when I go to duel. Like, apparently duel is actually 3v3. It's kind of a weird translation. 
I don't think there's like 1v1 matchmaking actually now that I'm looking at it. But right now I'm really trying to figure out how the CC mechanic actually works because it's really weird right now. Like I have these skills that say they CC but sometimes it just does nothing. It just doesn't. Like, this is supposed to CC, right? Nice. Okay, and, I, and he just dies instantly. Okay. So I guess we're... I didn't even see how the other guy died. I guess we're just ganking this guy now. So, like, I don't know what class this is. He has, like, this crystal immune skill. And then, like, he just went into that again. But see, he's not getting CC when I dash onto him. Like, I thought, like, the dash is supposed to be a CC. Like, this says it makes them unconscious for two seconds. But he's clearly nothing's happening to him. So this mechanic is pretty confusing right now, so far. I guess we just keep going. Let's keep healing. And then there's also this like, smash golden shell. Like, reduce the golden shell status. Wait, I wonder if that's a mistranslation? No, it's not. Wait, see? Quick approach to stun the target for two seconds. And reduce the golden shell stat. Like, that's also not explained. Like, what is the golden shell stat? And does that have to do with whether they're being CC'd or not? This is all a very big... Hmm, right now. So I'm pretty sure these are real players this time, because they they all have PvP gears now. Whereas yesterday, everyone had PvE gears. So yesterday could have been bots. But these guys are probably real, I think. And it also means. It also means that um the player info thing isn't trolling. Because these are probably their actual gear. And these guys are actually moving like real players. You DC? Oh, welcome back. But these guys definitely are moving like real players now. So we have the fan, the clown face, and the gold coin. I guess they just all rush in and immediately get ripped. I don't even really know what happened. That was... Like, what the fuck was that? This guy did 24k damage? What did he even do? How did he do that? How did he instantly kill two guys and did 24k damage in like a fraction of a second? So when you were when you do it like when you get to the level and do the tutorial, it gives you PvP gear as a part of the tutorial. And then that's the gear I'm using. And that's that looks like the gear everyone else is using right now as well. Except for this guy. This guy isn't geared. Yeah, this guy is not geared at all. 
I think this guy might be just doing the tutorial now. That's why he's not geared. Whereas I've done the tutorial, so now I have gear. Which is really... Which is kind of, like, dumb, though. Because, like... It doesn't make sense that you get the gear as a part of the tutorial. Because in order to do the tutorial, you have to go PvP. So how are you supposed to PvP without gear? Like, it should give you the gear first, and then you do the tutorial to PvP. Like, it's backwards, you know? You know what I mean? Like, not only do you actually have to PvP, you also have to win a few rounds before you even get the gear to begin with. <laughs> But that's why yesterday we thought like some of them might be bots because they all behaved weird. But then it's like maybe not. Where is this guy? I'm just doing like so much damage. Just pressing R and B. What is this? What is going on here now? Oh, uh, now I'm like really low. I, and I need to save this guy. Damn, how did I die? Wait, how did I die? He wasn't, he was totally stunned right there. That made no sense to me. What was that? He was stunned, but then I died while attacking them. Meditating? I I noticed that I can actually use this skill, rapid healing, during uh during the dual arena. So I wonder if I can even meditate. Well I can meditate now, but like once it starts, I think it changes. Actually, what I, I should have probably also like been using my buffs. Because my buffs make a huge difference, it seems like. Like, I can increase my damage by almost by double when I use this, and I can increase my attack speed by like double as well. I don't know how damage calculation works right now. I was trying to figure out the whole thing yesterday, but none of this really made too much sense to me. I don't see any 70% damage reduction skill. I have a 50% damage reduction skill. But that's about it. Anything else, I, I'm, uh, I'm clueless about. I have, yeah, I only have a, I have a fifty percent damage reduction skill, but that's about it. But at the same time, right now the TTK is actually way harder than I expected. Like, like I was seeing how like all of these skills have like two minute cooldowns and such. And I thought this would be a very l slow TTK game. Like this is twenty seconds. Like this is forty five. Like I thought this game would be really slow, but everyone is. Dying in like 30 seconds or something right now. I don't know if that's just because everyone is just inting because they're bad, or if this is actually a high damage game. It's hard to tell. Not to mention, I don't even know how the CC system works to begin with, anyways.
Wait, what class are you playing again? Summoner? Ah, okay. And that must be a class specific skill. But there's also like the stat though. Like there's this uh this stat. Where it says predicting the enemy's attack reduces their damage by 70% and skills have no side effect. Like that just makes zero sense to me. Like what does it mean to predict the enemy's attack? And what does it mean skills have no side effect? <laughs> I'm guessing it means the skill won't CC. So how do you like predict an enemy attack? It's not like RNG? What 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 is what is going on? Just a big, a bunch of questions right now. Okay. What? I, I wonder what class this is, where he just keeps going into an ice block. What class is that guy? I don't know I don't know what class these guys are. How does it like I don't know how everything works right now. Like my class right now it seems like I can do a lot of damage if I do like killing without a trace, followed by Phantom Storm and I hold down RMB. But I don't know how to set it up, because like I do this skill. But it sometimes it just doesn't stun. Even though it says it stuns. Predicting maybe avoid. Uh... Maybe, but I don't know, because I feel like sometimes I, I, I get the uh, prescience. Like when you just attack, like even against mobs, sometimes they'll pop up and it says prescience. And I think what that happens is that you do like less damage when the prescience procs. So I think it feels like it's an RNG proc, where you just has a chance to do less damage. But I don't know if that's the true case or not. It's just so badly translated right now. Yeah, you can queue what's up to a team of three. It looks like it's a 3v3 thing. And it even says... Um... Actually, I don't know where it says that. But it said... Hmm... What? Well... I mean, you can create battle squad. Uh, see, I don't, I don't know about all of these stuff right now, but like, actually, this isn't. Wait, no, this is completely different though. Because I have matchmaking, and this is three v three. 
than that battle squad. And the battle squad can have up to five people. So how can the 3v3 have a squad of five? I guess you can sub people in. Or maybe this is just completely different. Like there is the Hong Meng Society. Hong Meng Society. Where you gather a hero stool, provide the sparring platform, help new students. Like is this even related? And yeah, there is 15 versus 15. In fact, I think I can actually queue into this right now. And then, because like it's 10 a.m. to 1 a.m., right? I might actually be able to queue into that. I'll try it after this. I don't know how long the queue is going to be, though. Do we have like that many people playing the game right now? Oh, wait, this guy has like 92k HP. Wait, why does he have 92k HP? I don't get it. Wait, what? Does he not have the same gear I'm using? What? It's like the same shit. Why does he have 92k HP? Huh? What is going on? What the hell am I missing? Bro, what is going on? How do you deal with this? I guess like that. You just have to get out of it. And I did 13k this time. Just by doing what? Like, I guess that's just high damage. Like, I just went in, pressed a few skills, and then I just did 13k. Like, do you just throw in, like, do you just go in and throw in your DPS? What's going on? And how does that guy have more HP? Yeah, I don't know what class that is. All right, let's try. Uh, let's try queuing in for fifteen versus fifteen. See how long that takes. If anyone's doing it. So I wonder. Actually, hmm, hmm. I have. Uh, I just thought of something. Let me go take a look. Because I, I know I can upgrade my weapon, right? But can I upgrade my armor the same way? Mm, where was it? It was... No, it wasn't this. Oh, where did I... Where was it again? I forget. Alright, no, it's here. Like, I got this one. So I can actually upgrade to, like, quality 55. But, um... No, the armor are all exactly the same. That's not it. All of, Like, I can only get a better weapon, but I can't get better armor. This is all the same as what I already have. So that doesn't answer anything. How did that guy have so much more HP? Got like a whole 500, 500, no, not even 500, like 800 more.
and another thing is like what was what were what were those rewards they were talking about like i did not see any rewards like after every fight it said collect rewards but i don't see where i'm still collecting them. oh like here oh that's so convoluted I have to go there to collect reward But I only got, what, two lotus chests? That's it? An amulet coin? Dual seals? Continent currencies? Like, why are there so many fucking different currencies? Like I got I got twelve point seven K continent currencies now. <laughs> Not to mention, where do I even see how many of all of these currencies I even have? I just see how disorganized everything is. Like can I open at least some interface where I can see every currency I have right now? Like PvP and Gucci. Like I guess I guess there's open world PvP. Because this is like karma, I think. But I have not figured out how to do that. Even even at the slightest. Like, this is, like, what, what am I looking at? How's, how long have I been here? Four minutes? So, so yeah, I have this weapon, which is what I have right now. But none of this explains why that guy has more HP. And I could... Buy... Level... Actually, I could already buy this, which is better. But in order to do so, I need... To reach the combat phase, Songs of the Battlefield 4. But what the hell does that mean? What the hell does that mean? Do I just... Oh wait, someone's already in team. For this. I think I just... Leave team? Because I'm already in matchmaking. I don't- I, yeah, I'm already in matchmaking, so I don't need to recruit a team. I just stay in the matchmaking, right? And then it's like... So this is how you, like, recruit people to do dungeons and stuff. But I don't see a need when you can just do matchmaking. I'm gonna leave there. there there's, like, this annoying background sound. But then it's like, I, I get that I'm in Bronze League 2 right now, right? I think that's what it means. And I have 1,300 dual seals. So like, can I go to this guy? Go to him. Actually, no, all of these cost like... 
tens of thousands of dual seals. And so I can't afford any of this. Not to mention, they cost like more gold than I have too on top of that. So the only thing I could realistically buy right now is not this because I already have all of this. But like from here, like I could actually buy like these things. Wait, is it going to let me? No, see, I can't, because my combat phase instance is too low. Which means what? Also, I've been in this matchmaking for seven minutes now. I don't I, I don't think there's enough people right now doing... Doing 15 versus 15, is there? Like, there's not that many people who who has access to the uh, beta. I don't think they gave out enough keys for us to have 15 people queuing up. Especially with how long it takes to even get to level uh, 37 in the first place. I kind of question if we even have people, enough people to do this whole thing. So 15 versus 15 doesn't work. Can we do free for all? What? It's only open to teams of five. But that's not the troll prison. This is the pestle user defined, huh? I'm looking for land of the emerald clouds. I don't see that. Huh? It opens Saturday and Sunday at 1pm, but when does it close? It doesn't say that either. Uh, okay, Songs of the Battlefield 1. Okay, I'm at Songs of the Battlefield 1, which means what? I need to do more Battle of the Continents. I need to do more 15 versus 15. But can we speed up this matchmaking? Oh wait, we actually got a match after 10 minutes. There's actually enough people playing, it just takes 10 minutes to find the match. So wh what do we do here? I think it said there's objectives. You're supposed to collect 1,500 uh, Sochi, right? So what does this mean? People are mounting up. I guess I should mount up too. Except I can't. Oh wait, no, I didn't open my mount. My bad. That was just weird. I had to open up the mount first. Okay, so I guess I'm on a mount. Is this like Dominion? I think we have to capture points, right? At least that's what it looks like. I don't know, I guess I just follow someone or... I don't know, look at where the team's going and just go somewhere. I just already decided I'm going down here. It's better to it's better to attack down than to attack up. And then there's the five elements, the five elements from Chinese mythology. Wait, these guys are... these guys have wings. What the heck? Why does he have wings? Wait, what? And I got a buff. 
that gave, gave me 10k HP here. How did I get that? What am I supposed to do? Do I press C? Oh, I press C. To occupy. But I guess one, our teammate already did it. No, wait. Do we all need to press it? I'm, I'm confused. I guess we go iron now. I want to move this. This is kind of in the way. Move that here. Alright, so we're just fighting now. Okay, he's dead. What? How did I get CC'd? It's actually hard to chase down people. When they can move and do ranged attacks at the same time. Did I kill anyone? <laughs> okay, so that guy's running now. And I think we... Do we... How do I tell if we... Oh, no, from here. Okay, so we got that. Okay. We got iron. So what's what do we need? They, they have fire and wood. Okay, well, this... It's actually kind of annoying that I can't look at it from M. I just have to memorize. Fire and wood is like... Where's wood? Wood is on all the way on the other side. But there, I see some of their enemy here, so I guess I should support, so they don't uh, capture. Wait, why couldn't I? I couldn't move there for a second. That's weird. Damn, that guy's running away. Damn, wait, I can't attack when the water. What? What is this? I can't attack when in the water. This is like nation wars. Yeah, it's called it's called the dom domination or dominion. I think like the game mode in general. Wait, how did I manage to spawn in a point that's already being cont like uh, being contested? But do we have this point? This is earth. We have earth. They have fire, so I guess we go this way. Oh, uh, healing works here. Okay. Like you can just respawn right right away. Wait, so you can just respawn right right away after you die. How is everyone supposed to take it then? Berserker, Spell Sword, Spear Master, Reaper. I don't really know. Generally, I just assume no one heals, anyways, but that doesn't really bother me.
But now I'm... And honestly, I don't really want healers anyways. I guess we need to go to wood now. I guess there's only one person here. Oh no, there's two people here now. So, why, do, why is it that we always are able to spawn back at Earth, no matter what happens? Is this just like a point that they can't capture because we just have like our spawn point here? How, how are they ever going to capture Earth if we always spawn here? Where do, where do they spawn though? Also, wait, hold on. There's no way I can get up here from this direction. Well, I'm trying to get up to wood right now, man. But I can't figure out how to do that. I guess I have to go the long way. Like, there's no, ma there's no mountain climbing in this. What? How is how are they able to be become, become a crystal? Like that doesn't look like a class specific skill because he's also a berserker. So that's not a class specific thing. I'm the same class as he is. So how is he doing that, and why can't I do that? Oh, and how did he just absorb all of that? He just absorbed all the damage. What is going on? Like, are they even taking damage? I really can't tell. Like, what are the conditions to deal damage?
I assume if I queue again, it'll just be uh, with the same people, right? So this one should be faster, hopefully. And what did I even get? Did I get anything? I can't tell. I guess I got I got combat spirit. Was this was this higher than earlier? I don't. Know if, I can't tell if this increased or not. One time, what is this? Gold of the four C. There's a fishing event. Find a golden fishing hole and go fishing. After entering the arena, the spirit seal will open automatically, allowing price fish to be caught. After 30 minutes, the seal will close and it will be teleported back to Thalrise. Yeah, this looks like a fishing event. We even have koi. PDO simulator. Okay, yeah, this time it was much faster. Looks like it's probably... If you queue in after one finishes, you, it's a much higher chance to get in again. Because I'm assuming there's only like maybe 30 people doing this or something. So we're always blue. Or are, are we always blue? I guess we'll see. I spawned in the same place two times. I didn't spawn in that place one, one time yet. Wait, what are these? What type of mount is this? What the heck? What kind of mount? <laughs> what the hell? Oh wait, I didn't even see this. What is this? Invincibility pills? What? What did I get? Did I get anything? Bro, what? I, I don't think I got anything from that. Does only one person need to capture? I'm guessing so, right? How do I kill up? Should I just meditate now? <gasps> or or oh, I just regenerate fast enough naturally? It looks like the base regeneration is pretty fast actually. I'm getting like I'm like 50 every every half a second. It's so hard to tell if people are like dying or for what. A moist shot? Uh, not right now after this round. Okay, I capture this. But then like these, how are these guys just respawning here? How is it possible that they respawn somewhere we just captured?
Or maybe someone had to capture this? No, it's already activated. The one now. They're still winning. Wait, why couldn't I move? Wait, why couldn't I move there? I used the uh, CC break. And now they're here, but we're respawning here. they gonna capture wait how did I get like what did I even get CC by just now by this guy wait what how did I die this is so confusing Also, the wolf does like so much damage as well. I just noticed. But I'm not doing anywhere near as much damage right now. So why is that guy not taking any damage? Wait, now he's taking damage. Wait, what changed? And he and that I it's that ice skill again. Everyone has this ice skill. Damn, that guy is healing faster than I can DPS. How is he flying? Why can't why can't I why can't I fly when in combat? What the hell?
Wait, how did I die? Wait, how did I die though? I'm so confused right now. What is going on? Like, it doesn't feel like anything's really hitting me. You want to capture the middle back, but no, that they're all spawning there. That's going to be difficult. Why is that? Why is why, why are all of us here? Where, where, where is anyone? So we're, just, we're just losing now. What the heck? How did that even happen? Now we have wood again? What the hell is kills and kills? What do, what does it mean? I have three kills and six. What does what does that mean? Thirty assist. What does that mean? Bro, how is this so scuffed? Okay, so... There's one thing I was going to do. I could actually buy these. Like, I have the money to buy these. But should I buy them? I'm assuming so. I mean, I can... I can afford it, so... I should just buy it, right? Like, there's the mixed goods. I don't really need these, right? There's writ of the continents. And there... Wait. 
Why do I have 13k writ of the continents here, but when I go here, I have only 50 writ of the continents. What? Are these not the same item? Huh? But I mean, it's not like these are useful, right? You can use Shadow Hunt Red to hunt students of the Chin League? What, what does this mean? This gives me a quest where I can hunt other people? That seems interesting. But then the other question is like the dual items are level 70 are quality 70 and then the continent items are 60 so i should be getting the continent items first i think hey what's up i'm in call now Uh, I'm doing the PvP tutorial. That's all. GG. What did you want me to get into call? What did you want to talk about? Nothing. I I, I just want to listen to your bullshit when you lose. Then what do you mean you you don't need I don't need to be in call. Nah, it's it, it's more real real time. You know. It is it is real time either way. What? No, it's like a ten second delay. Mm, nope. So it's uh, real time for Sasu. What? I guess, you, I guess you have worse internet than her. I guess so. Damn. Damn, it's because of your shitty router. Yep, it is. Is uh, Yasu the max yet? Yasu? Isn't that a League of Legends character? I I I, I don't know. Damn, I thought you were uh, you played League of Legends. I don't know, man. You don't know about what? Anything. Anything of in real life? Mm -hmm. I see. That's unfortunate. Why? Why is my queue not going now? My queue isn't popping now. Damn. It popped so fast last time. So I think I should actually get the um. I should get the quality 60 items right now. Even though the quality 70 weapons are better, it's uh, worth it to get the quality 60 first. Are you best player NA now? Uh, a Berserker? How am I best player NA? When have I ever been best player NA? Well, you've been, <laughs> you've been playing this game straight for like three days, so I figured you gotta be best player NA by now. Mm, no, that's not how it works. Oh. You have to it's, actually it's, be good at games to be best player. But you're 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 Asian, so you're naturally good at video games. Nah, that's Koreans. Oh, okay. You know, I'm only Chinese. Oh, Damn. Okay. Damn. Got that. Good. Yep. You're putting yourself down like that. <laughs> it is what it is. <laughs> Damn, Wayne's getting new PvP gear. I don't know if I should get the um Wait actually I can't afford this. Wait, what's the other item I could buy? Like I could either buy Yeah the the wine from here or the wine from here because so, so so it's either 60 or 70. So either 60 jewelry or 70. I should buy the 60 ones first. But, but I could buy. Stat I can't afford the seventies. Oh. But I should buy the sixty first. So I can either buy Are you making these money now? lines. I just PVP. Maybe. I can't really tell if I'm actually making money or not. It's hard to tell. 
like I think I am. Go, like, how, how is it hard to tell? Does the numbers go up or down? <laughs> or do they not move? <laughs> well, see, in order to know whether it goes up or down, I have to know what I had before and what I had after. And the thing is, I don't remember what I had before. So, you know, yeah. I can't tell whether it went up or not. That bad, huh? It is but that have you, bad. Have you been buying new pieces and not doing anything except for PvP? Well, so far I have money, but I don't remember if this money came from earlier when I was doing PvE or if this is money I got from PvP, you know? Well, I gotcha. So I guess I will buy some stuff. Let's, let's buy some stuff, you know? Oh, but here's another thing. I need, I need to get, uh, how do I get shades? Hmm. I'm assuming I got the jades from the PvP. But I'm almost out. I only have four jades now. How do I get more? Damn, I'm in another seven minute queue. Is this a 10v10 or 15v15? 15 versus 15. Very long queue. We have unclaimed reward. Oh, I got this now. See, I leveled up my songs of the battlefield. I think, or combat spirit, or <laughs> or something. What's, what's I'm at one thousand one thousand six one hundred sixty now, and I got three battle of the continents chest. And by opening it, I get a large amount of runestone, Ufa, and by one hundred fifty ten continents. So this is the PVP currency that I got. And uh, you, you get gold? Wait, so yeah, 380 gold right now. 380, and then I open another one. Uh, wait, I do get gold. I am getting gold. Yeah, I'm at 390 now. So you do get gold. And I'm getting PvP seal stones. Alright. So, 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 so this might be Wayne's game. If you can make money just playing PvP. Check. And wait, and I'm also getting the PvP currency and PvP seal stone. What? Level 3 PvP seal stone? What the fuck? Yes, but I don't think I even need it right now. Because this is for quality level 90 PvP gear. And I have not even seen a single PvP gear that's the quality level 90. Oh, just use it then. Like, the best one I can buy it looks like this one, which is only quality level 70. So where the hell do you get a quality 90 PvP gear? Is that even released? I, maybe you have to upgrade them. Upgrade? How would you do that? Damn, I'm forced to PvP with my PvE gear. I know. In, Calm in down, everyone. Like, what the hell, man? Secret stone. We're receiving unconscious. Oh, unconscious light crowd control effect. Include stun, freeze, daze, and petrify. That's your talent for berserker. Yes. You mean the crowd control effect kicks in for thirty percent of that the effect mean? duration? Wait, what does that mean? I guess you're not allowed to. What? So I guess if I get CC'd, I can't get CC'd again a second time? Once that CC ends? Yeah, after the color control ends naturally, like, you don't break it. Or... The other thing that I don't get is how some people have, like, a immunity skill that makes it... them uh, invulnerable to all damage. I don't get how Is that the golden that. shell? I don't know. But I definitely noticed that it's not a class specific thing because I saw a Berserker use that as well. Damn. Healing Rejuvenation. Um. Wait, what? How do you even get this? 
Oh, oh wait. Okay. What? Elixir? I guess you can use Elixir to get, give yourself charges of this skill. And then you can use that to increase your edge or healing during combat? Going to array. See, all of these have zero potency. You need to, like, charge them up with potions or something. Yeah, like, all of these have zero potency. They don't regenerate naturally. You have to charge up your skills to be able to use them. Oh, receive a golden body for 10 seconds. But what does that mean? How do you and how do you charge them up? Alright, good luck, Wayne. What is going on? There's so much. And I don't even know how do you even how are people doing the uh, ice barrier thing? Ask them how to do ice barrier. No, I have to figure it out myself. <laughs> Oven of life. See, I get Elixir of Immortality plus one, but what, is, what did that buff me was? 6% EXP, I think. I don't see it. Or is HP. Oh, maybe? increase my max HP by 6%. Oh, it was hidden. Lazy competitor? What? You were very passive in the Battle of the Continents? But the game hasn't even started yet. Damn, it's that bad. It's crazy. What? And this triple jump cannot bad. triple jump cannot be used. And then you get higher limit access to all breath of condom increased by 300 per then. So that average PP equipment level is not lower than 70, so this is gear balanced. Wait, this is gear balanced. So if, wait, if this is gear balanced, then what's the point of PvP gear? Why even have PvP the, gear if it's gear matched other anyways? Forms of other P for the other forms of PvP that actually matter. Like what? What do you mean? This is the PvP that matters. Maybe, well, maybe this is just like the fun PvP. Everything, like there's everything like maybe is like fun PvP. Maybe like like the the ranked arena isn't gear matched, and that's like the oh, stuff yeah. that matters. Hmm, I actually, that could be the case. That, that's kind of the way they did it in WoW for a while. They had like some sort of, they had like a weird normalization system for Battlegrounds, where your stats were automatically tuned to how P, or how Blizzard thought they should be. And then the arena, when you got into arena, your gear affected it, but like it was only incremental. Wait, why, why, why don't that, you... That could be the case. You have a but the reason call. why uh, it was really important for Arena was it wasn't necessarily the stats that helped so much. It's the special trinkets you got and the, the special trinket usages. Trinkets. I guess after you kill them, your character says you are very yep. strong. Damn. That's just, uh, tr you're just trolling them, I guess. <laughs> Damn, I guess if one day I'll, I'll play video again and a PK someone on, that's, that's, that's what I'll say. So <laughs> you are very strong after you kill them? Yeah, you are very strong. What is going on here? Bro, I don't... It doesn't feel it doesn't feel like I'm being hit by anything. Like none of these, none of these attacks like sh register. Yeah, there's no impact or feel yeah. to it. Yeah. Yeah, not, yeah. Like, is there even sounds that you're getting wounded? Like, oh, 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 oh kind of shit. <laughs> I, I have you muted. <laughs> I not that I can hear, but I already I, I usually have it, the background music down pretty loud too, but. It doesn't really feel like I'm even being hit or anything. Yeah, like yeah, the animations like kind of feel scuffed. Like especially how like you know when you're in combat, you're just walking casually, like 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 what I'm doing yeah. right now. You know, <laughs> like, like, in the, like in the combat yeah. dance or anything like that. Yeah, it's like you're just casually having a stroll. Damn, 
I have to win. Yeah, it's really hard to tell if I'm like even hitting anyone. Where well, you see the damage numbers come up? Yeah, I do, do but. Well, I mean, you, what is you going on here? Bears hitting you. I don't like how there's numbers all around your screen. Like, can you not just make it a little more neater? That's a good question. Maybe that's why BDO didn't, didn't want to showcase hit damage. Well, BDO doesn't really need hit damage either, to be fair. Well, like, but there should be an option to enable it. The, the whole critical damage and all those things are super distracting. I disabled those right away in BDO. Like the uh, the hit detection. Or... Uh, well, I mean, that does kind of help, actually. It tells me if, like, the CC landed or not. Like, when it says block. Like, I can tell. Like, I can see that it's blocked. Yeah, better true. Than, better than listening to the sound. Like why? Like why was he not taking any damage right there? Like that, his HP did not drop at all. Like that's what I don't get sometimes. And so he just got he just healed up instantly. You guys look like you just get zerged. There's like three of you there, and there's like ten of them there. But, but we're winning. Oh, but you're winning. Yeah, we're winning somehow. Are you on the blue team? I think we're. I think I'm always on the blue team. Here's what it looks like. This blue team always says friendly team. Oh, true, true. Is there like is there like objectives to this or like? Yeah, this is domination. Oh, okay, so there's three points that you have to hold and just get points for it. There's five points actually, because it's uh it's Chinese, you know. You have, there's five elements in the Chinese lore. Ah, uh, gotcha. <laughs> gotcha. I guess I combo this guy now, but then he, he's not really taking much da much damage from that. Okay. I feel like range is also useful in this one as well. In group content range is always really strong in group. I th like, someone is healing me, but I can't really tell. Like, what's going on? And how did I take 5k there? Got dumpstered. This doesn't really make sense. But what even hit me for 5k? Like, I hate how it doesn't show you... So the damage you take together. There's no problem showing you 50 different numbers of yeah. small little uh, damage things that like, you do. Like, why not just group them together? Yeah. I guess that guy's dead. Damn, Wayne's team is like winning by a lot. What do you mean, damn? That's a good thing. Damn. Someone's carrying. And then I just get knocked back. That was like an AOE knockback. Yeah, apparently Spear Master is like OP. How is that OP? What do you mean? That's, that's what everyone says in the chat. Isn't that, is that the bars? I see. I have two kills and I have four kills. <laughs> like, what does that mean? I, I think one of them is your death. But which one? 
Probably two kills, four deaths. Damn. That's, why do Why do you say that? Because you Because you, I saw you die more than twice. I don't think that's a real thing. <laughs> 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 what do you mean? Uh, I, I don't think that's a real that's thing. That's just not a real thing, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry to break it to you. Wait, but how do I get my reward now? Mail? It's not the mail this time. Maybe you have to wait. See, it says I already. See, it says completed now. When I tried to claim the reward. Oh no, it's daily event. So maybe it's just a daily reward. No, but it, it's not though. Oh. Because it's because every time it ends, it says there's rewards. Like you see, there's there's like reward bonus, bronze chest, and stuff. Maybe you haven't reached there yet. Or do you only That's get a reward if you win? Look look at your combat spirit. Maybe you have to reach but to we the did next. Win. But we did win. Yeah, so like we won though. So I should so I should get what the bronze oh. chest, right? Mm-hmm. Well what if it just automatically goes to your okay, character and you don't know? But where would it go to my character? Like if it's a bronze chest, I have to open it, right? Who knows? Where did Game it go? Very confusing. Not this. It is. It's very disorganized. Damn. Like, I feel like you can make a one hour video just explaining every mechanic and where everything is in this game. <laughs> but nobody knows because the translation is so bad. Well, that's why you have to figure it, figure it out and then make a one hour video of it teaching everyone else or, or else the game is going to die because no one will know how to play it. So I think when you guys think you're Chinese, these two go into the Chinese version where you get to see the proper translation <laughs> and then translate everything for everyone and make a big guide and become a big YouTube sensation for this game. Be like the North American ambassador for Swords of Legend. <laughs> The problem is I can't actually read Chinese. Only Wally oh, can. GG. Only You're Wally can Chinese. read Chinese. I can. I okay, can. Well, then... No, but see, if someone speaks Chinese, I can understand. They just can't read it. And yeah, then you guys have to do a collaboration. <laughs> yeah. So 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 Wally had to read it out. <laughs> yes. We we need Wally's help. Well, to go to the China version, and teach us how to play. Damn, I I think you get like 15 gold every time you win. Did I? I didn't notice. Yeah. I'm a 408 now. Yeah. All right, let, let's let's see after this one. Well, let's see if you win or lose first. Does it matter if I win or lose still? Is that one leap dude, the F Nedo? I guess he's the healer. Is that what that is? And no, that Shiro. Mm, I don't know. Maybe that's what the symbol means. I mean, they are a bard. Bards are the healer, right? So, damn, he got he got that skill. He got the immunity. And then he and then he healed up again. What the heck? Their heals are so good. He's now he's now healed to full. What? Oh, he's the bar. So, what, 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 what can you do? Not be Damn, OP. Wayne's Wayne's aiming for the bar. How could you? What the fuck was that? What is like? Why are these guys sometimes immune to CC though? Oh, 
Oh, getting gank. Like sometimes they just take no oh. damage. How many times have you died so far? I'll count. Is that one? Let's say twice. That's why would why would again. why would it be twice? What? Why would it be twice? I say twice. Why why would it be twice? We we don't just say things <laughs> for no reason. What? Why is there an invisible wall there? That's so scuffed. Because they, they they don't want you to cheat. But, but that's kind of like the whole point. <laughs> Damn, 1v1 one one right here. Let's see who wins. Oh, it's 2v2. Two 2v1 two, two now. What the heck is this? What? Like, what even happened? That's just... What even happened? I don't even get it. Like, I was at 8k HP. Man, I don't understand Bar. What what is that fucking ice thing around them? The ice thing. It's like an ice barrier shit. I think everyone can do that is what I oh I think. Because I saw a berserker do that too, like this thing. I saw a berserker also do that. Yeah, that ice barrier. No, but I saw a berserker do that too. It's really? not just Bar who can do that. But that, so I don't uh, know. I don't know how they're doing it. And I guess when you, when they glow gold, it's the golden shell, maybe. Yeah, the gold one for sure. But how, but like, how does, how, how do you get the golden shell? I feel like you only get that when you CC break or something. Oh my God. Translation so bad. I'm going to quit this game. <laughs> Translation so bad. You're going to quit the game, I guess. Yeah. I guess that's that's the thing. People, people might just immediately quit this game before they even get to the PvP. Mm -hmm. If they don't clean up the interface and translation. That's why that's we need to make it, a video to teach people how to play. It felt too, too rush, honestly. We need, we, need, we need people to like, to teach people how to like, how everything works. But how can you teach them if you don't understand it yourself? <laughs> oh, that's why we have to be good. That's why you gotta play Chinese version, so you know what each thing means. Wait, so... Why is this guy not dying? Why is he so tanky? Because he doesn't want to die. Oh, you missed and that guy, And that guy healed to full just Wait, now. the golden shell, what the fuck? Yeah, like, how, how was that guy not dying? What was that about?
And where do we go now? Water? But see, there should be a shortcut, I feel like. You know? Since since you can't design this map in this way where you're supposed to be like martial artist, I feel like you should be able to climb mountains and stuff. Yeah. That, that's what they do in the uh, Wuxia stories, you know? And then I hate how, like, you have to keep opening the map to tell which one is which. Because it's not color coded. Like how did how did that happen? Like how how what was that about? That was like five K damage or something. See, that's one thing I liked about WoW with their damage thing like that. It told you what skill did that damage if you wanted to. You could see that information. Crazy. Like I don't, I don't get it. I mean, so I did, so, so I died three times. Did I die three times? Yeah, I, I, I think you did die three times. Clack reward when you press the clack reward. But there's nothing to press. See, did, I can't press it. So did wait, I did, get it or not? Did I get it? Did you won or did you lose? I lost. I no wait, we won. So you got eight gold. Did I get eight gold? I don't know. It's either ten, nine, eight, or something like that. I don't know. I think I did. I was at four hundred eight, right? Mm hmm. But how did I get it? Was it this thing? See, this they don't tell you. Like, it just automatically go to you. This just went thing. into my inventory? Yeah. So, like, how it's... much do you know right of the continent do you have? I guess if I hover over this, I have 118k. Alright, alright. You have 18k? Alright, now do another one and let's see how much you get. Okay. I have 18.75 K. And but did this increase? I think my combat spirit was already 1,160, right? So why is this not increasing? Wait, but I'm supposed to get 60 combat spirit every time I win. Bro, this game's hard, bro. <laughs> bro. <laughs> it's not sandbox. What do you mean? Not sandbox means this should be easier, not harder. Yeah, but it's, it's, usually you don't have a story-driven sandbox RPG. <laughs> yeah, the sandbox uh, would be... means it can't be story-driven, that we can conflict with each other. So which one's better? Dual gear or Battle of the Continent gear? I feel like they're like I can't really tell, but when we go when we go here, right? Actually, wait, where where was that menu? I can't even find it anymore. God damn it! <laughs> but here you unlock like these types of gears. Mm -hmm. But then the question is like you go to the Battle of the Continent, you have like. Thousand bell, which is a quality seven, and then you go here and you go to like equipment of the duel, and you have freedom, which is also quality seventy. What makes them? 
And this one uses exclusively dual seals. Make no sense. So I don't know, let's see. This one is what, like 9.2 perception? And this one is what? Like 27.7 perception? Wait, so this has way more perception. No, wait, this has. Wait, no, no, no. Wait, hold on. Thousand Bell or Song of Praise? Thousand Bell give 24.7 perception, but this one gives 9.2 perception. But they cost the same. But that one gives what? More physical strength. Way more physical strength. So I think, what, this one is for. What, one's like more one is more tank and one is more damage? Oh, that's true. So one's for Slayer and one's for Drunken Master. No, because they're both for Slayer. You see how it says Mastery? Like, at the top, Mastery, Slayer for current Mastery. So these are both Slayer items. In fact, if I close, if I turn off Drunken Master, like, they're both for Slayers. Then what? There's none for Drunken Master? I think there is. If you turn... Actually, wait, what? Is this bugged? No, one of them has to be for Drunken Master. They're probably too lazy. That's why they put how, what Slayer. You, but how can they both be for Slayer? Okay, because what they're, do you mean? they're fucking lazy. They don't want to put <laughs> Drunken Master, so what? they just put Slayer. It's the translation. Come on, man. That cannot be a translation issue. Oh my god. How okay, listen. You... Drunken Slayer has two words. They don't want to put that because they're lazy. <laughs> that's, that's not a real thing. I don't think that's a real thing, but... Oh. But this one has more perception. And that's the only... That's the main difference. Everything else is the same. Actually, wait. This one has more mastery, though. Well, mastery increase your damage, right? Yeah, but see, if I were to get this item which is a quality 70, I would actually lose 18.98 mastery for some reason. Or if I were to get this item, I would only lose 2.100 strikes. So how does that work? Why would I lose 18.98 mastery? Isn't that a bad thing? Shouldn't I, shouldn't I have a more mastery? And then we're asked if I were to go here, and I go here, actually I both, so these two are the same? This is Heavenly Freedom, and this is Fruit Sust Freedom. But what? Heavenly Freedom and Freedom are the exact same stat though. Yeah, see they're the exact same stat, they cost exactly the same, so what, what's the difference? They're both for slayers. These two are these two weapons are identical in every possible way. It has to be a difference, because why would they do such a thing? <laughs> why would they do such a thing indeed? See, this side is heavenly. This is freedom wine. This is heavenly freedom wine. So what what is going on here? All right, and then and then what do we have? If we go to these things, compared to my current item, makes me lose like physical like hundred strikes. So maybe. Like, maybe it makes up for it. Like, I lose that specific stat. But when compared to the other stat, it makes up for it. Damn, I'm still in queue. I don't think there's enough people playing the beta right now for there to be like 50, constant 15 versus 15. I yeah, think we, I know. Might we, we might have to like do some, do like two duels instead and wait for the game to release for 15 versus 15. This right now is like 10 minute queue. That's worse than spell break. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> 
There's also this. Uh, there's also like karma. I know. I I know this. So there's some form of open world PvP. I think, right? If you can. Yeah, have there's karma. some form. Of... Oh, you but said it's, it's not, not open. It's not out yet. We really? we don't have it. Yeah. Maybe they're still uh, translating it for us or something. I, I don't know. I mean, it's not like they're doing a good job with that already, so... What would be the real difference if they just release it untranslated, you know? What the fuck? Someone challenged me to a duel. Damn, I guess are you going to accept? Time for you to wreck them. I guess so. You have no choice. And then what's the difference between the Battle of the Continent equipment shop? Damn, and I got defeated. Advanced. I'm trash. Damn. What the fuck? Damn. And then it says, this is, there's still a long way for me to, damn bro, I'm trash. Fuck damn. <laughs> I guess there is a long way for you. Uh. Oh, you still have much to learn. What can I say? Fuck this game. It's trolling Damn, me. Damn, already quitting. <laughs> game is already too hard. Oh, so, yeah, there's glyphs. I wonder if one of the glyphs were from... The, oh, do you soaring up? Soaring, so, sobering up is really good. Sobering up. Wait, but is it good, though? I don't know, I think it's good. I mean, it only makes you immune for five seconds when you're about to die. You know, when you're about to die, I feel like Damn. being immune for five seconds is the last thing that you really care about. I guess it's not that good for Wayne. Well, you ideally don't want to get below 30% HP to begin with. But you will always be below 30. No. Yes. Not if you're good. <laughs> exactly. Let's see. Replace the Swift Swallow with Traveling Swallow. What? What, the what hell is that? that? What does Can that mean? Replace the swift swallow with traveling swallow. The swallow doesn't come. I think. Oh, it's it's based on like. Yeah, it just lets it teleport to the nearest phantom. I don't. That's I don't know. So if that's, ass. that's kind of really niche. Like you have to be like if you have to, if you want to play this class with a heavy emphasis on phantom usage. I think that could be good, you know? Like, you could do like this, and then you can, like, make them go there, and then you can teleport to them, you know? Like, if you want to play heavy phantom usage. No, I'm not heavy good. phantom user. The swallow doesn't come. Change in nature. In the windbreaker state. Let's see, we'll All we'll strikes are consumed automatically. I use Wind Silent, Torn Cloud, and Dense Forest. Wind is Silence. Damn, you're increasing the number of teleport. But Damn. see, the Dark dark Forest Swaying Grass lets you Overlord. Oh, yeah, Dark Forest. With only a 30 second cooldown. Yeah, I guess. I, I guess. don't know if that's actually good or not, though. And this but it says wind you, return. You, you cannot recover a strike. You cannot recover strikes while you are recharging. Yeah. I think that's already the case though, isn't it? Really? Wait, wait, so all, all of this PvP gear, can we use it for PvE? I think so, but maybe it will be bad for PvE though. Really? I have to try it out and see. That's what I assume. Do, do you have like level 60? Uh, gear quality already? That's what I was gonna get, but I guess we first do this after the 11 minute queue. The queue time is too long. Honestly, there will be more PvP if they made the fucking leveling, uh, much bigger. Yeah. Wait, how come every time I've been, like, on, down here? I have not been up there yet. They don't want you to be. What kind of logic is that? 
And I, how do you use this? How do you use loud seeing blade echo? Loud seeing. Damn, this guy is changing to heals. Damn. Damn, playing healing just. Healing is OP, what can I say? Just for this. Hmm. I hate heals. Damn. Wants to become friends with you? Who is this guy? What do you mean? He just wants a friend. Come on. But I don't know him. Damn. How can I become friends with <laughs> someone who I never even talked to? That bad, huh? It is that bad. It's crazy. Is it really? Is the mount really faster than the sprinting? Uh, like, I'm, yeah. like I'm, all, like I'm, all, I'm pretty much just as fast. No, it's quicker. Only, but maybe slightly. I don't know. I'm pretty much just as fast. Well, I mean, you, 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 you can wind glide if you like. I think the wind glide's actually slower. The skill? Yeah. No. What's the skill? Wind gliding, purify. Really? Yeah. I don't know though, maybe that's just me. Damn, these guys are just staying here defending. Oh, actually, it is, it is pretty fast. Alright, uh, you know what? I'm gonna buy some gear. Level 60. Wait. How did he heal up so quickly? He probably used to like, rapid this, this guy, healing. this guy is healing up so quickly. What do you mean? He's a bar, of course. How is this possible? Well, he he's a healing class. How can they all be bars? No, but how are they <laughs> healing when being stunned? How are they how are they healing when they're stunned? Yeah, it's like a cost of fuck right there. I know, like. Can this guy die already? Like, what's going on? Why is this guy taking no damage? I don't, <laughs> I don't get this game. Well, when the translation is so bad, the game just become that bad. <laughs> like, what is going on? Why do they sometimes just sit there taking zero damage? Now I'm just fucked. How did all how did all of my teammate die? Oh, that's why your team is just Well I mean you're winning though, so <laughs> Is that really better though? Or just do seriously wounded report. Now see it's all of well there's nothing to report there because I just got ganked. <laughs> but see it's it's really about the personal KDA, you know. No, no one really cares about capturing points. Damn, it's all about KDA. Let, let's, huh? let's be honest. But, but the game doesn't record your KDA. It records your wins. Yeah. And loses, I believe. If you have no high KDA, that's all it mat That's all that matters. But, but, but who, who would know? Because they don't record your KDA. What the fuck was that interaction? How did I just lose like 5k again instantly? Did you see that? What was that? Like, yeah. what even happened? I don't know.
And why couldn't I block that? See, my I see. Cannot like, be blocked. Why? Why? Why can that not be blocked? What? <laughs> cannot be blocked. But well, why? It's blocking frontal. Maybe you were attacked sideways. Is it, it doesn't say it's frontal. Does it say it's frontal? No, but you, you have to assume because the translation is so bad. See, everyone's going for Earth, but Earth is just impossible because the spawn point is so close. So we need to go for like fire or something. Because your teammate is it, it doesn't have that high IQ like you. <laughs> no, I think Earth is just broken. He, like the spawn point shouldn't be so close to the to the actual points. Wait, is this guy still alive? The fuck? Damn, he's memeing. Damn, I'm being ganked now. Kek, you got ambush. But like, I do no damage. That's why it's real mastery is just much better. It's not. People right. need to stop blaming their own incompetence on the class. Damn. I think we need to like capture the spawn point as well. Like down here. To deny respawn. Like what? What was that? Now, now he's going glowing gold. Wait, how did I? How did that do five k? You did 5k? See, how, how, how is my HP so low already? You didn't even do anything. Wait, you, you're bleeding. Damn, the fuck? The bleeding is like 200 per Like what? What is going on here? Like, what even happened for me to take 5k damage? So now, so now I guess I, I go for wood. Because people need to stop fighting for Earth. Earth is just broken. Maybe people just want to go to Earth just for the heck of the fun of PvP. They, they Earth, don't want Earth to, is uh... broken. I don't think that's a real excuse. Damn. Damn.
Wait, but I didn't get the kill. Wait, I think once we capture the point, then it unlocks the respawn. Oh, so we shit. have water and wood. I guess now we go. Now we need to recapture fire again. Damn, man! I guess we lost. How did we lose so fast? Wait, how are people getting eleven kills? I'm not doing any damage. Maybe it's time for you to get level seventy gear quality. It's gear matched. Oh, I don't know then. Did I, my points didn't increase. Wait, did any of this increase? No, no. no I got more, I got more writ off the continents. I didn't get oh, any combat so spirits. Well, maybe because you lost. But then why did I get writ off the continents? Because you participated. Did it say that? I don't see where it says that. I don't know. What? I'm doing a... What is going on? Dungeon right now. Pretty kek. Should have done more dungeons yesterday. Like, what is going on? How do I get more of these the jades? I don't even remember where I got the jade from. Can be inserted into socket. Did, did, I, did I get jade from doing PvP? Because I, I remember I only had like three jades or something. But now I'm at four again, so I must have gotten one from something. Also, this time, why is there no PvP buff? Like, where's the cauldron where I got the PvP buff from last time? Wait, here's here it is. Who summoned this? Is this something that people have to summon? Because there wasn't one last game. No one's capturing? Bruh, the bystander effect. Everyone assumes someone else is gonna capture. I 
And yeah, I spawned at the same place every time so far. What is going on? What is going on? Are people just healing back all their damage? Alright, that's one guy dead. What is this? Knockdown? We're just being pushed back now. Wait, why? Oh, the, the shades just have a mind of their own. Sometimes. Sometimes they don't really attack what I'm, what I'm trying to attack. Wait, this guy's a skill to full instantly again! And now he's completely immune? What the heck? Damn, I hate these shades. Bro, how did he heal back to full? What is going on? This is starting to... I'm getting fucked with. Oh, what? Like, what is going on, man? He's, he's finally dead. Wait, that's a spirit animal? That's not a real player. That's his summon. What is this? What are these things on the ground here? Okay, they just back away and we just capture the points, right? <laughs> That's funny. We just captured the point and now they're fucked. What was that about?
Bro. I did not mean to teleport there. Man. Like, like I feel like some of these skills just have a mind of their own. Like, I'm trying to teleport forwards, but it teleports me sideways. So that means this is not a real action combat game, which is fucking retarded then. Oh my god. Do we have this? We have we don't have fire. No one's taking this either. Where, did any, where was any of our teammates right there? What was that about? Oh my god. Wait, why, why was I not able to CC him? Wait, what the fuck is that? How did I just take 8k damage instantly? How do I do 8k? Like, this doesn't tell me anything. What is this? This battle report is useless. How am I, like, third for DPS, but only have two kills? Like, what is going on? Also, wasn't there like a training thing? I told you how the skills work. I don't even know where, where that is now. Yeah, I don't even know where that is now. What the fuck? Is it this one?
I mean, I already know this. I know this. But this it doesn't really talk, tell me. Like, you're facing opponents with a powerful golden shell. You smash golden shell to destroy it, but I don't. it didn't really say what a golden shell even is to begin with. Should I be using this skill to do damage? But this skill does like so little damage in PvE though. <laughs> Wait. You can configure it so that you automatically say something when you use the skill? You can be like a fucking... those anime characters who shout every attack they do. That's funny. I mean, it's funny how this game has so many random mechanics. But it's sad how like it's just over bloated and how so many of these are poorly translated and organized. Like more mechanics is not always better. Finally, I'm at the top for once, actually. That's interesting. Actually, I want to just disable that animation altogether. Like, anim animation is kind of annoying. Some, it's like. Yeah. I mean, it would look cool if this was a first-person game, but no, this is a third-person game, so it just looks super out of place. Like, you just go from third-person instantly to first-person. This is really weird. Okay, he's capturing. Okay, well there's like four people coming this way and all of our teammates going this way. So... Guess they go this way as well. Oh wait, we're red team now. We're not always blue. Okay, okay. No way. So we're not always blue. Yo, damn. You can finally be red. There you go, Wayne. I just thought blue meant friendly, but no, it, it switches depending on what's which is which. Wait, what the fuck? How did I get CC'd? Is it the, these sword things? Oh, 
The fuck? Time to just out. What the fuck? How how did that happen? Like what even is that? Like bra. Okay, I'm not going this way, I guess. I guess that point's just lost. Just accept it, and we go for the middle. See, someone needs to just capture. Like, we just, like, if we just capture, okay, then they can't spawn here anymore. I think that's how it works. Okay, now they're also now they're all coming this way. So either our team comes to go, turns around, or we just lose this. This I guess. No, I think we just lose this. So we just go down here now. Did someone capture this? And then hopefully... Maybe... Oh, this guy's running away. And then I guess maybe our team can come back and fight? No, that's not happening. We're just going to a new point, I guess. Or maybe it is happening. No, that doesn't look like it. Are you even good yet? Of course not. What kind of question is that? Don't you see the title? It says I'm inting. Although I guess technically this isn't even really arena. This is 15 versus 15. Arena is 3v3. What do you think of PvP so far? Pretty confusing, but... Very confusing. Or, like, what do you it's, mean? it's cause like, for some reason... You can't really tell what skill is being used. Like, it's really hard to tell if you're even being hit or not. Like, I, I just, like, you see how I lost, like, 3k right there? I, I didn't even really see him hit me with anything. Like, it's really hard to tell who's attacking you. Or if you're even being attacked to begin with. Sometimes I just lose 5k instantly. And I can't even tell what happened. But the the TTK is actually pretty good though. When you compare it to Elyon. Like you know how Elyon was like super slow to kill. Like this game is actually pretty fast TTK. So that was kind of uh, surprising. As, like, at the first I thought how every skill has like 30 second cooldown was going to be a slow paced game. But no, the pacing is actually pretty fast. But what I don't really get is how, like, sometimes people seem to just kill me instantly, but, like, sometimes when I hit some some people, they just take zero damage. I don't get how the damage even works. 
like sometimes people just go full immunity or they go from like almost dead to full HP instantly. Like that, I have no idea what's going on there. Like, I'm gonna try and kill this guy now. And that's uh, like, what, what, what was even that? But then I don't get how I lost HP there. He, he was kind of, wasn't he stunned the whole time? So how was he dealing damage to me while he was CC'd? Like, I don't get how some people are doing 12, 121k DPS with 9 kills. Right now, there's like two types of PvP right now. It's 15 versus 15 or 3v3. I think it was 50k was my damage. And I only end up with like two kills. Which seems impossible considering how everyone has like 10k HP only. So that should be at least five, enough damage to kill five people. Also don't fully understand how damage works like this skill it does 90 points of damage but when i use this skill it does like 2k whereas this skill does like 290 points of damage and does like almost nothing from 1 to 10 give the game a rating um too early to tell i'm gonna i don't know i guess i guess my first impression is like a six because you um it, the the 15 or 15 is gear matched so it's gear equalized and the fact that uh but you can like kind of have this separation of pvp gear and pve gear and then you can earn pvp currency and get pvp gear then that's only good for pvp so you don't have to like become a PvE grinder just to do PvP. It's so like on that alone, like that's already a plus five points. Um, but then it's like not like right now it's super confusing how everything works. Like the the lack of feedback. I gave Elion the six. I don't I didn't raid Elion. What? When did I raid Elia? Oh yeah, the PvP lacks feedback. It's really confusing. Oh 
I don't think I raided Elyon at all, but... I mean, Elyon... If I were to raid it now... Like, I mean, just, like, conceptually speaking, 6 wouldn't be bad, but knowing now that you have to, like, do a bunch of PvE to PvP because it's not your equalized, I don't know, maybe, like, it drops down to a 4 because of that. Like, if the PvP was gear-matched, or you could, like, kind of do in this game by and you where you farm pvp gear by doing pvp then i think alien would actually probably be like six or seven what the heck i was able to use play hard resonant i i, I don't know how What the hell is Play Hard Resonance? The buff. You mean Loud Singing Blade Echo? <laughs> is that what it's called? Loud Singing. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck you call it, man? Fuck now. Loud Singing. So this is better than Elyon? I mean, it could be, because. I don't know. So far... Oh my god. I can't believe that has happened. You've got to be kidding me. But it could be better than Eldeon, cause when I like I don't know if you saw when I was doing the um what they call the dimension portal or whatever. I posted a gif of that and it was just like a huge stalemate fest of just warlord chaining protected area and mystic healing. It was like a whole minute of no one dying. Like that was just instantly bad for me. Yeah, I, I did fall off. And this is like the only place in the entire game where you can fall off to your death. And this is a safe zone. Like there's no, there, like this is a safe area. They meme you by that. Like this entire place is only, it's just like a city. And this is, yet, yet this is the only place where you can actually fall off to your death. Fucking <laughs> the worst Berserker in A. Uh, it's just the worst PvE player in general, I would say. <laughs> yeah, like I feel like that's why I said. Like, Elyon as a concept, it could have worked. But the support skills are just too strong. Like, they need to, re like, if they remove that, it could actually be good. Like, in, like, it's like on PWI, like, one cleric is OP, but that's only because of EPW, but on, like, official servers where they don't buff the hell out of clerics, it's actually pretty balanced. Whereas on Elyon, like, one Warlord just instantly negates 10 people. No matter what it is. A single Clerk can't do that on uh, PW, so... If they nerf that, then maybe Elyon could actually be good. But then I looked at, um... I looked at the assassin gameplay of blue and for some reason it, I don't know where he was fighting but it was much more skirmish like in his video there wasn't there was barely any warlord mystic grouping up 
he was just picking up, like he was just skirmishing on the side constantly. So I don't know if that's a type of PvP content that they get in KR that we don't have it yet. Or, or what's going on there. Because if it was like what he's shown in his video, then it wouldn't be nearly as bad. Simply because in his video there was barely any Mystic Warlord third game. So I don't know what's preventing them from doing the same thing in KR. I don't know if you know the video I'm talking about. Yeah, I think Elion is gonna be like, uh, like PW, you know, where you just damage trade. But not even at like PW, more like, I don't know, more like, um, EPW, where everyone's just Rose Archer and targets the same person. One sec, one sec. Okay. Um, yeah, what was I saying? Yeah, PW you can lock down targets. Yeah, you could, but I guess like if this was like EPW where everyone has expel, as soon as you lock someone down, this is expel, or like faith and then run away. I guess it could, it could be kind of thought of like EPW style where everyone runs expel. Yeah, not only is there spam little CC immune, there's CC break every 15 seconds. That's pretty broken. And the fact that the CC break itself gives you CC immunity, like that's that's what I don't understand. Like sure, CC break understandable, but you should be able to outplay it by like tricking them into breaking early. But you can't do that because the CC break gives you CC immunity. Damn, what the fuck? I'm the only one going this direction. Damn, literally everyone's going the other way. Wait, they're PvE player playing PvP. You you have to, you, you have to be nice. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> they're PvE players trying to PvP. <laughs> Once you use switch, you're guaranteed dead. Yeah, that's that's the, that's what I'm saying. Like the cooldown is so short. But I guess if you're on EPW, like after you faith, you have enough genie energy to to uh, AD right after. So you, have, so you just have to treat it like the EPW style. Uh, I don't know if you saw the blue video though. Because he was like capturing people pretty well. I don't know how he was doing it. Wait, what what the fuck is this? Bro, what is this? What am I what am I what what what's what is happening to me right now? We capture the point. I think they're capturing the point, so it's fine. How the fuck did random trying speed do better than MMO of all time? I mean, PW wasn't a random MMO, though, to be fair. It was actually really good when it first released. It's just that the developer or the publishers were too greedy.
Although a lot of people actually liked it. At first. And it's even more popular in China. Like in uh, in NA, we have what, like... Eight servers originally? here well what am I supposed to do now what am I supposed to do now I I I, I don't get why you can't sprint when in combat that makes no sense to me why can't you sprint and double jump or anything when in combat? So it's way easier for them to chase you down than this to run away. Because they can sprint if they're just chasing you down. But you can't sprint when you're being hit. PW doesn't get the respect it deserves. Yeah, maybe. Does the moon care when the dog barks at it? Well, like, I guess that's what I'm saying. Like, I should have played Perfect World. <laughs> Nowadays, when uh, I don't have enough time and I can pay to win compared to back then. Game is dead. Perfect guard is dead. What the fuck is this run into the water? Are, are... Fucking water strat. money for a healthy PW server.
Yeah, but I doubt the publishers will like do a wild dead and make like a classic like uh, PWSR or anything like that. And honestly, even if they did, I don't think it like will be popular. Like I think it was pay to win too early in its lifespan for there to be enough people to care about playing a classic server. Like people will play classic WoW. But I don't think people play a classic PW, even if you made one. It was like full backing and everything. What the fuck? How did I even die? Like, that makes no sense. How did I just take 42k? When he was like being grouped, gained up, and CC'd and everything. Like, damage in this game makes no sense. And then this guy just takes no damage. Like, why is he not taking any damage? And then he dies instantly. What the fuck is going on? Are you seeing this? I'm so confused. What's going on here? Just two cats. Damn, we're, st we're still losing though. Damn, we lost again. How did I get 6 kills this time? But they'll still only do 53k damage. But I don't know, I guess... Perfect World is also kind of like... Not really... It's kind of like a unique concept, I guess? I don't know. Like, uh, Swords of Legend Online is basically, like, based on a Chinese novel. I don't think Perfect World was based on anything. I think they designed it from the ground up. Yeah, my, I think it was just based on Chinese mythology in general, not rather than any specific book. Like how Swordsman or Swords of Legend is. Whereas Eldeon and BDO are Korean games rather than Chinese games. A different culture.
Hey, how long the queue is right now, though? Right, let me just buy. Let me try buying some gear. Like this is good. Wait, is it though? Like I get less physical strength. Yeah, I don't get it. Like these are both herbs, right? Like these are both the same route. This is a master game route. This is a master game route. Like. But this one, I lose only 0 0.800 strike. Whereas this one is exactly the same, but I also lose 8.43 physical strength. And in turn, I get what? I get more sprint? Oh, I get more sprint and more mastery. Whereas this one, I have more perception. Damn, I leave and you're looking at gear. I come back, you're looking at gear. Like, where's the PvP, bro? Like, it's ten. It's ten. It's ten minute queues. Oh damn. Dead yeah. Game. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they they didn't they didn't give out enough keys. That's for sure. Like, I'm assuming this is maybe, like, what, 20% of people who would play the game at the start? But who knows? I don't know. So, like, do I want... So, the difference between this one... Physical attack is the same. Agility is the same. Tenacity is the same. Critical hit physical damage is the same. This one has more less physical strength. This one has more perception. And this one has more mastery or sprint. What the fuck? What do you what's why, why are you saying what the fuck? At the Q times? Yeah, the Q times are pretty what the fuck. But this is 15 versus 15, granted. Oh, your last three messages didn't go through. Oh, all right. Damn, Twitch lagging. Damn. Wait, you you might as well use your PVP seal, because I I don't think you're gonna get level ninety gear quality. I know. But I noticed oh, that there's actually all day? two and different you're still only gear level fifty. What's going on? No gear gain. I don't think I need gear gain. You see oh. here? Oh, it's all uh, it's all gear it's, match. It's, That's right. gear, it's gear match. Where, oh. where is it? Here it is. The quality level of all player equipment will be increased so that the average PvP equipment is lo not lower than 70. Uh, so this is like the fun PvP to get gear to go do competitive PvP in the arena. It's exactly <laughs> kind of how it was in uh, for a while. I mean, or you can just go do competitive PvP right away. You, you, cause yeah, you, you also just, earn currency. There's two different currencies. Th this is just easier way to earn currency because you're not, you're not you're getting gear checked. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> All the time about tap hurt but... versus action. Actually, you earn them all, I think. But the queue time, though. Right, the queue time is a huge problem right now. But I assume that's because this is the beta, and they didn't give out enough keys. I'll talk about tap target versus action combat, but maybe the tap target was superior the whole time? Well... I mean, there, there could, it could be tap target well done, or a tap target poorly done. Like, I don't think you can just say it's tap target, which makes it better. Like, at this rate, if you're gonna play a tap target game, you may as well just go to Final Fantasy XIV. Like, come on now. <laughs> 
You're not gonna go to some rip off money sucking Chinese MMO that just wants you to spend their money for four months and then close down servers. True. But I mean, like BDO isn't bad because of tab target, it's bad because design decisions they made. Like Swordsman Online 1v1 was actually good, and that wasn't tab target. But the mass PvP was bad because, again, design decisions with like lost arts and everything. And like how the red, like the day's mechanic works with the uh, the red. So I think it can't, it's not just because of action or tab, but it could be because people who made action combat just so happens to be people who don't understand PvP. Like, there may be, maybe that's the correlation. Rather than tap target or action combat being inherently bad or good. It's time to run away. Wait, how? Well, wait, can you attack me? Oh, jumping? He's jumping in the air and attacking you. That's hilarious. Wait, you can do that? <laughs> yeah, I didn't know, I know you could do that. That's what he's doing. I mean, PW2 being action combat or not isn't really going to be the main problem. It's going to be like, is it even the same developers who's developing it? Like, you can easily take a world and give it to a different development team, and then they just mess it up completely. Like, that's definitely not unheard of. It happens in movies all the time, right? You can take a success for a franchise, give it to a different producer, and then it's just fucked up. To be honest, that's kind of what happened with Call of Duty. Um, I think the original dev team left after uh, Modern Warfare 2, and they all went to create Respawn Entertainment, and that's where like Titanfall and Apex is from. And a whole new design team took over for the rest of the Call of Duty franchises, and you can see, like, there was zero creativity. Like, it was just the same shit every single game. I mean, P PW has been on the new dev team. Pardon? Perfect what has been on the new dev team I'm mentoring. Yeah, it's, it's, I'm just kind of saying like how Call of Duty got a new dev team. Yeah. And the whole game just went to shit after it. It just became like they didn't have any creativity between the different versions. It was just rehashes every year. And it just was kind of garbage. Damn, water combat is so bad. Wait, how'd I get up? I don't know who was the original dev, I think it was Arcosaur Studio, but they, they've been fired for a, lo a long time already. Like, the perfect world we've been playing was not, uh, we've been playing, like, even all the private servers, like, all of that was not developed by the original, the or original development team.
Wait, like... Uh, why, why, why is there no... Is there no spa immunity? Wait, this is so broken, though. Like, there's no spa immunity. Wait, but how are you supposed to play like this? There's no spawn immunity when you respawn. How why did they how did they think that was this was okay? Like first really? of all, why why is the spawn point so close? And second of all, why is there no spawn immunity? Like both of these are not okay. It's like these people have never even played a PvP game. Like, you don't need to think of this for longer than a few seconds to see that this is an obvious problem. You have no spawn immunity, and have the spawn be so close to a point that's being captured. I thought there was spawn immunity. There isn't. Well, act what? Maybe not CC immunity, or so it's basically the same thing. Hey Senka, what's up? Is the game still a 6 out of 10? I don't know, man. This isn't the only PvP mode though. Like there this is just a mode that they, that you can do. So if this mode is broken, I guess you can always do a different mode. Game is actually a two out of ten. It was a ten out of ten when Wayne started out, and at this point he's at a six out of ten. Give him like till the end of the beta, and it'll be a two out of ten. <laughs> what kind of I, meme I is this? I reached that conclu conclusion in like two hours. It it, it takes him because like I'm Korean, so I'm I guess I'm a real gamer. So what I figured kind it out of meme there. is this? <laughs> well, you said it yourself that Chinese aren't real gamers. So only Koreans are real gamers. That's not so. what I said. Yeah, well, you, yeah, that's what you said. Waiting in the arena queue. How's that. it going? Uh, it's just uh, trying to figure out how the game works and everything. Never played this game before, so everything is still pretty new to me. Like right now it's mainly I'm trying to figure out how the damage mechanic even works. I feel like some some people are can just do 5k damage to me instantly and sometimes like some guys just take zero damage. Like like this guy for example. I feel like I've been hitting him for the past few minutes. And his HP has been above 50% the entire time. And now I'm dead. There's just much more Spear Master player as you see. I don't think that guy was a Spear Master. Enjoying it so far? I mean, it's, it's okay so far, I think. Um... I was saying earlier that I feel like the PvP kind of is missing a bit of feedback. Finding it hard to tell when I'm doing damage, when someone's doing damage to me or not. Damn, how's that guy 13 and 3? But I like I like conceptually how you how there's gear matching, so you don't have to do you don't have to like be forced to grind in uh, dungeons all day just to compete. Like conceptually, that's what I like so far.
The right click chargeable in the phantom build. Yeah, I think I'm on the uh, charge build right now. So I have everything at the first one. It looks like to me the first one is all based on Cloud Ripper. All right, I'm swapping over for war. Talk to you guys later. All right, see ya. See man. But when I charge it up, I'm only seeing like 1k damage. What? No, you're supposed to do more. I mean, it's also what I'm seeing. It's also kind of hard to tell how much damage I'm doing. Like the numbers can just pop up all over the place on the screen. Rather than like one consistent place, like on top of their head, for example. So sometimes I'm not really sure if I'm actually hitting them or not. Unless I'm like constantly dashing my eyes around the screen all the time. But I did notice when I use this skill, it does like 2k instantly. Even though it says it's only 180 points of damage. So I think the skill description isn't like really indicative of how much damage I do. I'm not 100% sure though. When does close beta end? I think it ends on Monday, right? Yeah, on Monday. And then next week it will continue again, I believe. Oh, the charge build is not good right now? So it gets buffed later? Okay, okay. I guess that makes sense. I guess the publisher is streaming right now. But yeah, the Phantom... Like, when I, I do this skill, followed by this one, and like it's like by the time I do that, they're already out of stun. So I guess I have to, I don't know, stun them with like two seat, two stun skills back to back to pull it off. Maybe I could switch over though. Give it a try and see if it's better. Also, I think, um, I think they said that there's going to be a second close beta, like a week right after this one. So you might be able to PvP after all, Dante. To precast and build up your phantoms. Um. I guess I'll, I guess I'll just put put everything onto this for now and see what happens, and then go in. 16 phantoms, okay. 16 phantoms? How would you get 16 though? With precasting? Like I see that solar solar rider, I guess this skill builds up one phantom. But when I use when I use this skill it consumes like 25 edge, right? I guess what? I would only be able to do Six of them, just by spamming that. Are there other ways I can build a phantom? Yeah, so I have so I have this skill. Killing with all the trace. Followed by I guess spam solar rider five times. Is that the best way? Do I only have two skills that builds Phantom? Or I, can, I guess it also says if I auto attack, it builds one, right? Oh no, only if I'm in Windbreaker states. Seems like they're rushing this game out. That's not a good sign. Hmm. I 
I don't know if that's true. Maybe I just feel like it's it's as if they didn't um, get enough money to have the server on. Damn. They didn't have enough money to get a server on for a full month, so they just have two close beta back to back instead. That's why they're doing that special uh get twenty percent back. Oh you have the cooldown that should reset. We smell for four years, and we're only getting it now. Damn, that's like late and soul level of delay. Really, four years? I thought it was two years. <laughs> that's like late and soul level of delay. We've been lied to. What did, what have we been lied to about? The Unreal Engine update got announced. For, oh, they don't have it yet. Oh, okay. Well, I don't know. Someone told me that what they have the Unreal Engine for. But we also haven't been lied to because we thought it was already Unreal Engine four. So at least now we know it's technically still on Unreal Engine three. So I guess it's not bad that the game is uh, not better looking than Elyon. They're both on Unreal Engine 3, it's a fair, fair match. See, ain't got a new rate here. You think Eldian looks way better? I think they look about the same. Look, I can't I can't be holding down RMB now. I'm not too used to doing that. I need to press this skill now. It's it's hard for me to control the uh, the shades. I have to constantly be pressing two to get them to the right target. Actually, I feel like this this class is like better in um, in tar tap target mode. Because the shades, if I'm in action mode, they don't really go where I'm aiming at. It's just gonna go wherever.
It looks like we're, it's only Earth that we don't have right now. No one's taking it? Okay. I see immune to damage. I, I don't get how sometimes people just are just sitting there immune to damage sometimes. There will be a wipe after CB2, but not in between CBT1 and CBT2, is what this guy's on world trying to say. Some class has been immune. So, it, the, so it's only Bard that has the ice block? Because I swear I saw a Berserker get iced as well. Maybe the Bard buffed the Berserker. Oh, can they do that? I think so. Because uh, I'm, I'm doing dungeon right now and sometimes it says that I'm absorbing damage instead of taking damage. Damn. Oh wait, can't your teammates just troll you by ice blocking you then? <laughs> You're about to get a kill. <laughs> That's the <a> meme. Man, I'm doing this fucking dungeon and we don't have like a backup tank. It's just one tank and we die, we'll fuck. Oh, so it's all the so it's all the support classes doing all of that. Sound like the long range thing? I swear that guy was alone. Or maybe maybe there was another one supporting him from the back that I didn't really see. Maybe we should do research to mobile MMOs. Maybe they just have superior products these days. What? Which mobile MMO is superior?
I mean, even if they got more resources, you really want to play by tapping buttons one at a time. I don't know. Oh my god. <laughs> That did not work at all for me. I mean, you don't really tap buttons one out of time in PW though. Sometimes you, you have genies and stuff. Like why? Why am I? Like why? Why can't you get spawn camped? That makes no sense. I know, that's what I'm saying. Like, I feel like there's no feedback for getting hit in this game for some reason. And why can't you get spawn camped? Like, why is that allowed? Well, I don't think it's like BDO, where each death is a load screen. So that might not be a problem. Wait, what is this? Wait, what? I didn't even know that was a thing. I guess you can jungle. Jungle and get shield. But uh, you're talking about BDO, don't they? Where... Every time you die, it takes a load screen. But this game, I think it's not really like that. I don't know why PDO designed it like that. What the fuck? That was so much damage. It's like 5k me. Like, what? Wait, what? Bro. You have at least a starter PvP gear? I think I do. But isn't this instance gear uh, gear equalized anyways? Thank you. 
At least he died. <laughs> I think I think this is this is about right. And this is about right, right? And also you got this one as well. It's the level sixty, uh the sixty quality or or whatever. So is this like an older, like how old is the game that we have in the beta compared to the, in China? I heard that this is an older version. But how old, like is it? I'm just gonna run away. Damn, I can't run away. So this is like the first version of the game? At the start? Bro, so much is gonna change in four years. Three seventy. So much is gonna change in four years, though. Getting three classes. Yeah, I just mean like the game we're beta testing right now. It's not not going to be anywhere close to what the game we have that's in China. If it's a four-year difference. Archer class. Uh, it's the same game. I don't know. I, I've seen games with a lot of changes in four years. Like I, I don't like I came from BDO. I don't know if you've played that game before, but like when the BDO first started, it's a, it's there's so much differences. Like classes get completely different. Like, uh, like at the start of BDO, compared to now, now classes get an entirely two different styles that they can spec into. Whereas originally, they don't have either of those. Yeah, there's Awakening, and now they have Succession. And went from like, 9 classes I think at the start to like, 22 right now. And it hasn't, I don't think it's even been 4 years for BDO, has it been? No, it's, it's 4 years now. It has been 4 years? Alright, yeah. but still, like that's, that's a lot of changes. Oh, okay, so for this game, it's still the same? I guess that's good in a way. 
but it's not like we're testing it's not like we're previewing a game that's it's gonna be completely different when it actually releases no in, in Swords of Legend they, they released Archer it's, it's on YouTube already like the class mm-hmm Because here, uh, in uh, in Source of Legend, they have a class called Blade Master, like the Chinese version, and another class called Archer. Yeah. Yeah, unfortunately. I mean, that's what I assume, right? Oh, the fucking fox smart. No, no, no one's gonna play the fox lo lolly shit. Fuck that. I don't know what that is. <laughs> I don't know. It's like a lolly class or whatever. It's, it's, it's like SMO when they release that lolly. Everyone's gonna play it. <laughs> <laughs> No, what, what's going to end up happening is that they're going to censor the fox lolly, like the outfit, they're going to censor it, and then everyone's going to complain, and then they won't play it. I mean, if the class is good, then they'll play it. Bro, what is that sound? What the heck is this sound? Is someone doing this? What is going on? Someone's fucking memeing. Oh, PC will all bought fashion already. Yep. Damn. I guess they really want that uh, twenty percent bonus when the game releases. Why did he? Why did he pass through this place if he wasn't gonna grab it? Did Senka play Perfect World? I don't know. Did you? Uh, maybe you're thinking of a different person than Dante. <laughs> Alright, well... I don't know if the legendary intuition 
What do you mean legendary intuition? <laughs> What's so legendary? Intuition is legendary, my friend. I don't know what you're talking about, man. What? We just stunned each other. It's way harder for me to control the shades than this to this whole than it is to me to this fight with the sword. Maybe I need to redo the keys to really control the shade. Damn, you're absorbing damage. Who's blocking you? The heck, that's so OP. Oh. <laughs> Wrapped up my own stream for the day since my arena quest dried out. Ah, nice of you to uh, join us then. to go. It's only Earth that's not captured. I feel like it's... I guess I'll just... I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna defend here. Oh. We fly out of there? That's not a little bit of kill. I think I need like way more shade than that to even really do anything. That was an insignificant amount of damage. Maybe I f like that? I finish him off? <laughs> okay, I finished him off.
I mean, having range is good to steal kills, I guess. I guess I got healed. Like, this is such a long quarter. Yeah. Who can reach the most combo heavy classes? Well, it probably helps if I actually understood any combos, I suppose. So I kind of assumed every class has some sort of combo. I'm really surprised you didn't pick Reaper. You play Assassin on literally every MMO. I don't really play Assassin. Like, I, I, I don't know. I don't really consider myself an Assassin player specifically. Swordsman Online, I played Splendor. Like, I, I guess... How do I put it? I don't... I don't play Assassin. I play classes with high burst damage and good mobility. But not because it's an assassin. Oh, smash? Yeah, but too bad I had a uh, negative KDA. <laughs> Damn, it actually costs money to do these. You have to you have to pay money to repair your gear. I'm assuming you earn more than it costs, though, right? I think my money's been going up at least.
But I don't know if having good mobility and burst necessarily has to be assassin. Because uh, I was reading the Swords of Legend Online Discord. And they didn't, like, I guess those weren't really the terms that were used for Reaper. So that's why I didn't pick it. But maybe it is. Who knows? I'll, I'll, I just read the Discord and that's about it. I'm getting way faster queue now. Early was getting like 10 minutes per queue. I didn't think it was yours. <laughs> Are you queuing for like uh, duels, 3v3s? Ah, okay. Do you know if there's 1v1 arena? Or if one or is one v one just duel it's just like finding random people and, and requesting duels. Ah, oh, no one v one. All right. Optimization the same as BNS. I didn't play Blade and Souls. But right now I'm getting like what 55 FPS on Ultra? I guess it could be better. No damage though. Bruh. Cooldown of the dash skill, like uh, which one? The one where it's a dash normally? This one? Or the one where I like dash onto a target? That one. Just the meteor shower skill where I dash onto someone is 18 seconds. I think it's just normal dash, it's like 8 seconds. Oh, the hoverboard. This one's 39 seconds. <laughs> or 40. 
It's basically 40. GVG and open world coming later. But oh, that's good to hear. I I did didn't they say that there's gonna be open world in the second ghost beta? I'm assuming the open world is going to be like a place you just go at will, right? It's not going to be integrated into part of the current uh, story quest or whatever. Extra content patches come and level cap reserve skills will naturally get stronger. Oh, okay. Because I think we were talking about earlier how every skill at the top top right says current level 1 out of 1. So we were like... 1 out of 1 implies that there's going to be two, <laughs> 1 out of 2 at some point, right? Otherwise, why put a skill level? Which class has the most mobility? I actually don't know. I think uh, Senka is probably the expert here. I've just been playing this game like since um, since Friday. So I don't really know anything either. I'm just been I just been testing out the game myself as well. Also, will we Reaper? I guess Dante was right. Reaper is the assassin, assassinismo's mobility. I haven't seen the sword lolly. I think right now we have what the Spearmaster, the Berserker, Bell Sword, Reaper, and uh, Bard, I think. I 
think I got zero kills. I didn't get any kills. Damn. And I played Slash and DPS that match. Check. Um. They're aiming to have something at least every month or two. Ah, okay. I, mean, I don't know if shorter patches is necessarily always good though. Like it could be overwhelming to some people. If you have the meta shifts and new content so often. Like already the game has so much bloated content, I feel like. It's getting hard it's pretty hard for me to even keep track of what's what. And this is just the first version. Plus, the poor translation doesn't really help. And for new players, just trying to figure out what everything even means. Like, BDO is overwhelming, but this game... I don't know, I feel like this game has been more overwhelming than BDO already. But th th maybe that's because I played BDO for a long time. Need someone to, like, make a video explaining what everything is. Just looking at my stats, it's already a huge WTF. Am I travel faster than a mount on wolf form? Or as fast as a mount on wolf form, I wonder. I know, I'm carrying a sword into my mouth. Video is a lot simpler. I think so too. But even then, a lot of people were saying that they're overwhelmed by BDO. So what I'm afraid of is if someone comes in this game and the first thing they see is this UI. Like, they might just be turned off by the game immediately. Okay. 
I think I, I'm not doing any damage when they're like glowing gold. I wonder if that's like... Damn. This being... What is... What is going on? Why are these guys standing there? Alright, kill them. Are those... I, I, I like... I guess they're bars. They're just standing back and healing? It just looks like they're standing still, though. Oh, this guy is iced. Oh, he got ganked. Welcome back. After you do two phantoms, so you use Cloud Gripper. But but see, since I spec the full phantom, I need to charge it up three times now. My best Berserker in the A, of course not. What gave you that idea? I hate how I, like, I have to sometimes tap target. Like, the action combat doesn't really synergize too well, I feel like. Like, sometimes I have to tap target so it selects the person who I'm looking at. Pushing over now. The best to be whoever's at the top of the battle rankings. <laughs> Thank you. Wait, what's going on? Wait, that did not work at all. I thought I would be able to block it and counterattack. Unlucky? Wait, what? What do you mean? What's that? Like, that's, that's not based on luck, is it? Damn, he's still not dead. I already. Bro, where is he? How is he at full health now again? Wait, how, how is he at full health again? Like...
I don't even know what to say to that. I'm assuming he got killed by a bard. I didn't see anyone nearby though. Unless their healing is like practically invisible, maybe. Usually in games, it's pretty obvious when someone gets healed. Oh, a life steal. Actually, I'm out of here. Fuck. I died to. Oh my god. I to bleed. Uh, I haven't played League though, unfortunately. Fucking die to bleed. But that's why it's so strong. It's just, it does like 5k instantly. And it's like a grab or something, I think. At least, I, I don't really know if there's grabs in this game. That's what it looks like. But where's my, where is my teammate anyways? Goes back in time to a position where he was previously and recovers. Okay, well, I, I, I've seen skills that do that. I, I, I understand that mechanic. Yeah, so you can rush in and then, uh, Go back to your previous position. Die now? Now he's dead. get the kill. Damn, it's over. Didn't get to kill him. Alright, 1-1 to one KDA. Better than last game, at least. Everything, anything was better than last game. We won, even though all of them got the highest DPS. I mean, you were too when he has to use his ulti for you should feel honored. I mean, he said it was like an ult. Doesn't mean it is an ult. You know, on Spellbreak, Chrono Master works every uh, 16 seconds. Improvement? <laughs> uh, they press the skill, creating a clone, go in, blow their quota, then press the skill and teleport back, and reset quota and HP. I mean, yeah, but 
I think most people right now in, at this stage of the game is probably going for kills. It's not like there's really anything else where people can go just to get kills right now either, other than I guess 3v3. But everything else is closed right now. They can reset their cooldown, that seems really good. Because right now, cooldown is one of the main things I notice in this game. Everything is such a long cooldown. It's all like 30, like 25 to 40 second cooldown now, almost everything. Their <laughs> arena queue won't pop. Dead game. Hmm, I think they barely sent out any keys though. Like when you look at Elyon. It was so easy to get an Eldian key. Everyone I knew got a key. But then this game, no one got a key. Other than uh, when I bought the game and gave everyone some keys. Everyone has low stats, low haste. Wait, what's low haste? Is that sp sprint? No. Wait, which one? Which one is haste? Sprint is haste. Okay. Increases sprint. Okay, so attack and healing masters reduce. Okay, reduce skill cooldown, increase edge regeneration, reduce charging time. Oh, so okay, so I guess later on we're supposed to get much more, much less skill cooldown because of, we're supposed to get much, uh, much more sprint for haste. Like our skill cooldown is going to go down drastically later on. Oh, I guess that I guess that makes sense. Then that means the game, the pace of the game is going to become much faster. Not drastically. Six point five out of ten, I don't know. Yeah, smooth things out of it. I think I mean I guess if people look at the game right now, they might think the game is but then I feel the cooldown is too long, and then I guess when the when we receive a few patches and everything goes goes down in cooldown, maybe people should re revisit it at that time if they didn't like it now. I already have a few friends quit for uh, for that reason.
Damn, now I'm in a like a six minute queue. I would have thought that if I queue in as soon as it finishes, I would just do right again with the same people, but I guess not. Like there is an ELO for this, right? For like the 15 versus 15, at least I'm not seeing an ELO system, so. Yes, I'm wondering, hmm, maybe I wasn't fast enough. Wondering why I'm not getting a match now, all of a sudden. If it's not for you, it's not for you. Yeah, that is true. It doesn't mean like, did, like, like some key things I feel like would kind of change people's perception of the game. That's all I'm saying. Which is kind of why I do feel like if they gave us the Chinese version right away, it could actually be a good thing. Like the, um... Like I heard how uh, it's like only two hours to do PvP in China now. It took me 20 hours. <clears throat> it took me uh, 20 hours to get to this level. Or the and the questing wasn't really even that interactive. I felt if they just skipped the early games altogether and just jumped straight into where we're at right now, maybe more people might be more interested. But I don't know. You're in free 350 gear? I mean, yeah, but like, the early game in this is just not good, to be, like, to be perfectly honest. Like, the quest is just go here, press F a few times, go there, press F a few times. Like, I wouldn't even really call it content, to be perfectly honest. Yeah, questing is boring. Yeah, that's what I felt like, too. Like, I feel like some people, if you, you like, kind of are forced to get past the questing, and if you can't do that, you might just, you might just quit before you even experience the PvP. What MMO has good questing? Well, it's not so much, like, does the MMO have good questing, but it's like... No, it's not about the quest itself, it's about... How fast it is that you can actually get into in some get into some real content. Are they chasing me all the way here? Like I feel like on like on, on BDO for example, you pretty much immediately get into like kind of the the best part of it, which is like the combat. 
Oh well. I just died immediately, anyways. But yeah, like I, it's just like uh, like if we're talking about BDO, it kind of feel like immediately you get into the into the actual combats, which is what everyone enjoys about the game. Whereas in this game, at first you'd like just do a bunch of press F here and there. Whereas the actual content that people want is probably like this thing, but it's gated behind like 20 hours of PVE. Maybe I should just run away there. Like, I can only choose to respawn at the nearest elemental cave, right? Like, sometimes I feel like it would rather just respawn back at base. When you play last season? Hmm. I mean, technically, you shouldn't really need to quest anymore that much on BDO. Hasn't they changed it to mostly grindy early game? But I just mean, but like, even so, what I mean is like, in terms of what most people praise BDO for is how good they feel that the uh, the combat uh, the combat system is. Of course, I don't think anyone's going to be praising this game for having you press F a bunch of times. But that's all I'm saying. Like, sure, they're both questing, but in BDO, at least you're experiencing. What the game has to offer. I think the cosmetic and Wuxia theme is is what this game has to offer so far to you. I guess they're enjoying the game for the theme itself. Oh, that's always good. Did you enjoy the LDL more? There's just so many people here. Yeah, the video questing is better than most MMO because the combat is so good. I think that that's kind of what I'm saying. Like, 
like you get to experience the the main thing about the game as a part of the as a part of the questing. It's both questing, but it's like what it emphasizes. Damn, this guy's just getting healed. The early part, which is boring, yeah. that guy oh my what the heck bro that does so much damage I don't, I don't mind the uh, Chinese voice actor so much. I know some people actually prefer it being in Chinese because they like the uh, Wuxia theme. It's like how some people enjoy watching subbed overdubbed, you know, like in anime. So I'm sure some people actually like it this way. Maybe I can get to kill this guy. Alright. I only get kills on people who are almost dead. What is going on? Oh, we already lost. For launch, you won't have the option to turn the voiceover on at all? So they're getting rid of it altogether? Okay, now that makes no sense. Like, I actually get it if they don't have English voice actors, but to force it on people now. Now that's something else. Yeah, no, no, yeah, that's that's something else. A lot should only be English voiceover. Yeah, that that I don't get at all. I mean, how difficult is it really? You already have the CM voice actor, just have a button to toggle it. I know.
if I'm doing tutorial, the Chinese way saying everything I'm reading doesn't help. That is true. And it's, it's kind of worse for me, too, because I can kind of understand it, but also kind of... But I'm also trying to read the English at the same time. <laughs> I mean, I guess they didn't really want two different versions of the game, so they only have like one voiceover file. And you just have to run that one particular file. Was it if you're in English, you just replace it with the English one? That's what I'm guessing. I guess they didn't really want to bother porting over the, um, the English voice over to the Chinese version. They didn't feel like adding an option to toggle. How do, who is summoning this rep Oven of Life, though? Like, I see some people summoning them. They're not always there. Is that a thing you have to buy? Oh, Bard's passive. Is it like the loud singing blade echo skill I have? But I can't even use this skill. I have, I, in fact, I have never been able to use this skill. I'm assuming this is like what in dungeon only skill maybe? Oh, so this one. The wolf journey. What is this then? Is this like a dungeon only skill? Because I've never been able to use this. 
It's been always grayed out for me. I don't think I'm getting kills. I'm just getting assists. No, you can kind of tell when you get a kill, I think. It like pops up in the middle of the screen. If you, uh, like... I think you'll see it when I do get a kill. Like right there. Like that's the kill, I think. You see that? Yeah, the kill, the kill, the kill sound is nice. It's about winning, not the kill. Nah. We all know it's about the kills. Stay right, everything BDO does amazingly. So it's shot by Wizard and Sage Succession. And just the damage trade in general. something wrong here. I lost so much HP even though it was a 3v2. And then I died to DLT anyways. God damn it. Well, see, Pearl Abyss, I don't think they really PvP. I think a lot of the people who design MMOs don't actually PvP themselves, though. I died to DOT. If you're not at the top house, the people will know you're better than them. <laughs> It's all about the appearance. Damn, I keep targeting random, like... It keeps mistargeting, not the person I'm trying to attack. PvP should be the first priority of MMO. 
Uh, I don't, well, it all depends on the target audience. Like, we're not really the target audience. Of most of these MMOs. Like, that's why you have PvE MMOs, right? Like, Blue Protocol. Don't let PvE raid us hear you say that. <laughs> and I mean, technically Final Fantasy. It's the PvE MMO. It's just like... And people play it because of, uh, I guess... Competitive raiding. Hitting world first. Like, what the hell is that skill? That just did like 10k damage to me instantly. You gonna get the knockdown, maybe? And what even was that? Is it just him alone? Did, did anyone else hit me? I couldn't tell. <laughs> hardcore Raider starts to cringe. <laughs> hey, I mean, Wally's the Hardcore Raider. Or at least he used to be. You relate to Ollie. I guess we're just being overrun now. Or maybe I'm just being overrun. It looks like most of ours are dead though. Braves and MMOs are fun if done right. Close game. Yeah, that was pretty close. I actually feel like it ends a bit early, maybe. Or maybe it's just because of the queue time being so long. It feels like I'm almost in the game as long as it takes me to queue into a game. Maybe if the queue was instant when the game releases, it would be better. Why sometimes you do 2 guys, other times you do 32? <laughs> I don't know. I think that's what I've been like trying to figure out. But I think some skills don't do any damage. And some skills do a lot of damage. That's what I think. And then, I haven't really been using this skill at all. Or this skill. If I enter Vortex style, 
then I can use Phantom Storm to root them. Hmm. You like to have a balance between PvE and PvP in MMO. Well, I think that's the thing with MMOs, right? It ha there's so many different people who play MMOs, each with a different preference of how they want an MMO to be. I think no other game has that issue. It's just the MMO genre. And most developers probably just default to PvE because PvE is the more popular population preference. But then if you like, so that's why like games like Naraka, what they did, they went with a battle royale, but then they kind of only has one uh, type of players to appeal to, more focused when you do that rather than trying to make a memo. Maybe it's easier to pull off, potentially. And all in all, I mean, after all, the developers have to kind of know what to do to make the game good. And if you like, just find someone, like uh, just any developers, there's a higher chance they also will be more of a PvE player than a PvP player as well, so. Blade and Souls has good PvE and PvP content, but ruined by shitty FPS pay to an and dock company. Oh, I don't know, Twizzy. Maybe maybe this game could be good for you. Because it has uh, PvP and PvE, and they don't interfere with each other. Whereas on Elyon, you know, you have to do the PvE to, to do PvP. There's no, gear, there's no gear match in Elyon. This game does have gear matching, I think. Or at least... Even without gear matching. Okay. Oh my god. That was insane. Is that just a normal skill they can do? Or is that like an ultimate? You're more interested in BDO Dungeon? I, mean, I, I don't know. BDO, I feel like one of the best things about BDO is that it's open world. Making dungeons... Kind of generic and overdone. even disappear into. Alright, he's dead. I like how you trash talk them when you kill them by saying you are very strong. Uh...
die. Damn, he's healing so much. All right, there we go. We need to, like, someone needs to go and capture the thing. Go this guy? Oh, he's a skill back to full instantly. I'm just gonna try and sneak capture this, so they stop respawning. Like, that's- that- this is just the play now. <laughs> that's- that's just the play. No one was capturing. Now we get to respawn, hopefully. Damn, when am I dying? What am I even dying to? Like, who is even hitting me right now? Like, if PHS hire me, you make the best MMO no debate. Well, you're gonna have to make your own MMO to prove your, uh, to prove it first. Then they'll hire you. Okay, I got him. Why- why is this- why is this Earth always such a clusterfuck? Nice, two kills now. Three kills now. Damn. That's the most kills I got all, all day. What do you mean stop hacking? See, that right there just did no damage to him. I guess just using shades isn't really good enough. Well, we got Earth, but at what cost? We lost everything else. God damn it. DPS that, that guy. He just disappeared though. <laughs> Everyone's on this one guy. What's going on? That was like 10 people on him. <laughs> one for four trade. <laughs> yep. Nice. Four killed this life. 
But it looks like it's about to end. Looks like everyone's dead. Oh no, wait. They're still here. They're still here. Wait, what is... Wait, what is... Why is he stuck on me? The heck was that? What was that about? There's a moth. Damn, five. Pentakill. Pentakill to end it off. <laughs> Six to two, I actually went positive for once. Wow. Impressive. Name another player who predicted Swordsman and Blade and Souls dying. You know, if you just predict that every game in existence is gonna die, you'll be right with all of them eventually, so. I guess technically I am predicting that right now. So there you go. There's another person. I'm saying it right now, every game will die eventually. Hello? Hello? Hey, hey, what's up? Well, what's up, James? The stole my key. Stole your key? What? I didn't steal your key. I gave you a key, and then you said you didn't want it. Are you done with that yet? <laughs> I'm doing my homework. Alright. I mean, you can watch me PvP right now if you want. No, I, I wasn't even planning on playing this game because, like, the farming. Ah, uh, alright. But what's right. the PvP like? I'll, I'll watch. See you later, uh, Senka. Thanks for coming. Take care. Oh, what's the PvP like? The nice, PvP... when you're, actually, you're getting you're getting views. That's pretty the good. The PvP, I mean, right now it's like kind of it's kind of like Elia, I would say. Kind of feels like a bit of Elia. Tanky? You played Elia. No, not tanky. tanky. No, not tanky. It's like just the like the mobility of it. Like you can kind of attack while moving, you know, in that sense. But in terms like of what video. Uh, no. See, BDO, I wouldn't say it's like attack while moving. BDO is more like you move with your attacks and such. You know? Like you use a skill and you move. But this game is like, like this game, you're kind of like holding down your movement keys while attacking at the same time. It's kind of like El Leon too. Like you do kind of do that with El Leon. Uh, it's like, you know how Perfect Door, they have Stormbringer, right? How they have attacks mm -hmm. that, uh, moving, like, it's kind of like that. Yeah. And then... The damage, though, is way better than Elia. Like, people are actually dying really quickly. Yeah. So if you didn't like Elia because it was low damage, then this game might be better in that sense. Because it, it does high damage, right? Yeah, like BDO. No, not, not like BDO. BDO. Not like BDO. It's like it's still more tanky perfect than BDO. But it's like it's like Perfect World, maybe. Right, it's like someone. okay, I'm it's like Perfect you. World, but without charms, you know. Yeah, fight fight someone though. Well, I'm in Q for a 15 versus 15 right now. We're waiting for that. <clears throat> but sometimes this queue can take up to 10 minutes for some reason. I think not, like, either I'm too slow to re queue when the fight ends. Like, maybe I need to just immediately exit out without looking at my own score. So then I can immediately get into the next queue without having to wait. Either that, or my bad, bro. I'm doing I'm doing homework, so I can't really concentrate on both. But all right, it's fine. I can just uh, mute you on Discord then. What? I'm, I'm just being honest with you, man.
Well, no, you, 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 you said you didn't. You said you can't concentrate, so I'll mute you, so you don't have to uh, listen. <laughs> no, I'm talking about like I can't. I can't fully concentrate, like, like to what you're saying. I, yeah, I, exactly. So I, I can just I mute still, you. I still hear you while talking, bro. Yeah, so then you don't have to. You don't have to listen if I mute you. You know. Well, if it makes you, if it, if it makes you happy in life, man. No, I'm, just trying, <laughs> I'm trying to help you out, man. <clears throat> you predict the game dying within one month. I don't know about that. I mean, it all depends on whether people will get through the initial, uh... Leveling? Like, the initial leveling curve, you know. Like, if they get through that, then I think the PvP in this game, being how you don't really need to farm a bunch to get into it, it has potential. But, who knows, maybe not Naraka. Naraka, well... I think people who play this game probably isn't going to be the same population of people who play Naraka. It's nice how there's no pay to win. No pay to win so far. <laughs> but, uh... I mean, I also don't see how they would really implement pay to win it without changing the whole model of um, PvP and PvE gear being separate. Yeah, I know, I'm just, I'm just memeing. Like, I, yeah, it could definitely have no pay to win, that's for sure. Like, even Le League of Legends is a very successful game without pay to win. I mean, I'm just saying, talking about how, you know, on BDO, they promise no pay to win, and then get a complete 180 on that. So, you know. Perfect World was supposed to have no pay to win. Why can't I compare that game? I mean, it's definitely comparable. There's nothing inherent about the genre that makes it so that you have to have no pay to win. Yeah, but there's nothing inherent about MMOs that force you to have pay to win, though. So the genre doesn't really matter. Like, and MMOs didn't have pay to win back in the day either, so it's not like if it's an MMO, then it necessarily has to have pay to win. So the game can definitely succeed without pay to win. Back in the days? Yeah. No, not not like P, not PWI. Because PWI was pay to win as well. Well, eventually, I did start off without being paid to win. Runescape, yep. Or wow. And I guess Diablo is SMMO too. Maybe. 
I wish Diablo is an MMO. Because I think they have servers. Some mobiles have pay to win. Yeah, some mobiles do have pay to win. So that's what I'm saying. It has nothing to do with the genre. It's it's ultimately the uh, developer's choice whether there's going to be pay to win or not. You're not muted, Chase. What do you mean? I'm reading your text just fine. League is a perfect representation that you don't need pay to win to make money. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So I, I don't know why Twizzy says it's not comparable. Like there's MMOs that don't need pay to win, there's and there's MOBAs that do need pay to win. So I don't think it's a genre thing. Yo. Hey, what's up? We uh been doing fifteen versus fifteen, you know. Yeah, getting like top frag, getting most damage, getting nope. MVP work. getting getting uh getting bottom frag. But you know, we're doing it. I got third That's frag. all we need, right? I got third kill, third for kills and no war. One v one against BR. Damn. Second no war on Sage. <laughs> I guess uh, you're a top stage player immediately. Dude, Yarnko, uh, he just node ward uh, against Vertex. He got top frag against Cho. Sage as well. Like it's it's this is just it's ridiculous. What? So you think it's Sage? That's good. That's OP. Yeah, it's just OP shit. Nah, I think I think you're the best stage player. Dude, like everybody's doing well. It's very little. Like once you understand how to use the kit, it's so free. Like it's not. It's it's pretty hard for it to get punished. If MMO actually made high quality costume you put out consistently, yeah. And honestly, P PWI like kind of started off like that too, didn't it? Like PWI originally was based on costumes. Not nah, wow, I killed a streamer. Now I'm famous. <laughs> Damn, I'm the uh, last sitting now. Getting good at last sitting. This guy you're talking to sounds like a trash player, she. <laughs> <laughs> but didn't he wreck you on Alion though, Chase?
I remember he wrecked you on video. And you only managed to win you you won once. Out of like a hundred fights. There are no windows to catch a sage. They do unholy damage. Their biggest uh, time that you can go for them is when they're going for the grab. You can punish them then. Yeah, unfortunately I quit before getting a chance to fight it. Damn, he's just... Class was that? I think he just straight up out traded me. I recorded you chase one v one him. That was the last time he decided to one v one you. Yep, yeah, that did happen. But I guess uh, it's unfortunate. That you'll never be able to one v one him again. So I guess you'll always test the higher record. That's how you said it goes, right? You get an argument with the Suck Sage player that Sage was OP. Just throw Protected Seeds and you can counter them. Suck Hash has no Protected Seeds, I guess there's no counter. <laughs> what? Read me? Bro, what game were you playing? What game was I playing? <laughs> BDO? I think he's talking about BDO. I don't think you ever even got one off of me, did you? Maybe when there was a trial. I think it was trial versus trial. Yeah, he's still in 11, 11 3 me in a trial, but. Damn. I got I guess we just need to get like the, the video proof every time we gotta do uh I gotta record it. Yeah, maybe you two should do a rematch, I guess. Nah, he's too washed. Damn, too washed. Like, if he can't beat a warrior, there's no way he's gonna beat me. Okay. That is true. Chase got wrecked by Twizzy. <laughs> Chase can't even beat me on Hashi, has no chance. <laughs> Damn. Wrecked. You guys are really want to play the game again? <laughs> I mean, BDO has been uh, your favorite game, so. I mean, you hate Spellbreak. Brawlhalla is boring to you. What else are you going to play as in BDO? It's a PvE game, because then he won't get mad at people. He's going to let you get mad at mobs. That is true.
He is uh, really good at Left 4 Dead 2, I heard. I saw him play Left 4 Dead 2. That was that was his favorite game. Move the mouse, hit the left, hit the hit the left click a bunch of times, hit R. So with his speed. So what's that? Chase always rather you than PW. <laughs> All you guys be talking until you guys see me wrecked, y'all. Well, Chase, if you want to go back to BDO, you think you got wrecked? You have on your the account. Elyon? Like, didn't Elion wreck you so you couldn't even get into the beta? Yeah, that's that's the, the thing. You got wrecked by Elion. You got wrecked yeah. by the game itself. Uh, yeah. So. <laughs> Also be chasing SMO. That's <laughs> 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 so funny because Chase didn't actually play SMO, but he still got wrecked. Well, it's just like he got wrecked in Elyon, never playing the game either. Is your name hella familiar? Uh, you probably know him from Swordsman. He's also in the Discord. No, Swordsman. Swordsman Online. Yeah, he is the best swordsman online player of all with all classes right now. What? Who? Tony. Damn, Tony's that good? Yep, he is. Yes. We can cut out our classes by default because no one plays. G fucking G. Damn Chase, stick to one game. Why is there, everyone is going this way? I'm gonna get wrecked if I go this way. I guess I can't. I guess I wait here. Ah, oh, everyone's here now. Damn, you guys are gonna one v one in chess. Damn. Chase, did, did you get beaten by chess? At chess? By me? <clears throat> Yo, what's up, boys? Hey, what's up? I think Chase, yeah, Chase yeah. is like even with you in chess, right? Hold on, why, 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 why are you so loud? One second, I need to turn you down. After I uh, defend you. Yeah, let's first. go, let's go. Hold on, wait, I'll send you. Wait, I'll send you, I'll send you. One second, I need to turn you down a bit. Uh, let me do like 80%. That should be good. Hey. I linked it to you on the general chat. Just click it and then we'll fight. I mean, 
No play. It's random. Really? If yeah. Vendetta came back, would I join like Perfect World Vendetta? The thing is, I, I don't, mean... I don't think anyone will play Perfect World Vendetta anymore. It's like an old meta, but yeah, it was a good meta for the time. Chase, uh, you can press Control W to open up the the instruction on how to play. You guys are playing a chess game on the side. Don't worry, I believe in you. Damn, I didn't get the last Wayne. hit. Wayne, how's the PvP? It's like, it's not really like Swordsman, it's more, uh, I feel like it might be a lot more damage trade but there's also some combos depending on what class you're playing. Come, come watch this. Although not not saying I'm really playing it properly, but I kinda get the idea. Wait, is there a 1v1? In this there's game? there's no 1v1, but there is cute there is matchmaking 3v3. Oh. Uh. One v one is just dueling people in a, in like open world. Like like you know how SMO like you kind of like you do a bunch of skills and then back away. Like this game, I feel like you're kind of just like always attacking, always doing something. But it's a bit more damage trade than SMO. Levi. Is that Levi from SMO? On the uh, team? So, to say, the other person who played in China said that um, there isn't 1v1 arena. It, but there is like 3v3, 5v5, GVG, and, and stuff like that. Just not 1v1. Yeah, three three arena is just, is all they have. I don't want to 1v1 in Tic Tac Toe. Tic Tac Toe is a salt game. Yes, yes. Okay. I just want to put. Oh shit. You can 1v1 him on chess. If you want. Hold on, let me, let me try to find one. Connect 4 is also a soft game. But, uh, but um, it's... I think it takes more calculation, though, to solve it. But Connect 4 is a uh, forced win for um, the first person. 
What is that? It means if you play perfectly, the first person always uh, to go first and connect for always win. Whereas, whereas uh, tic tac toe is a salt game for as a draw. So if you play perfectly in tic tac toe, you always draw. Connect. But chess is not solved. That's why you guys should play chess. Yeah. Sure, sure. Hold on. <laughs> he died. <laughs> the most balanced board game? Well, chess, I think. There's a reason why chess is still alive after all these years. That's a competitive game. Uh, Chase. That. DMs? Yeah. Wait, how did, I didn't get the kill on that one? How? Oh. We're just missing water. We have all four, but we're still losing. Are you re-rolling when open beta? I might. Like, I don't really like the idea of controlling shades. To be honest. Like, I don't really like having to ma- like, uh... Micromanage another thing. I like it to be just myself. Unmute you? You're unmuted. I'm reading you just fine, Chase. If you're muted, I wouldn't be able to see what you're typing. Go ahead, Chase. You're first. Of course. Nice. Oh, it's a draw. How did you guys draw as soon as the game start? Uh, I don't know. Yeah. It is, but not always. Let me show you Damn, why. Damn, we lost. Yeah, like what's this build? I feel like I'm just mm. too focused on like pressing buttons. Nah, no, nah. No. I'm just constantly pressing things. Um, oh, draw. Like, what if I can I like rebind my LMB to maybe this skill? I can really- I never like press L and B, but I don't think I can. Oh wait, I could. I can just like L and B that. I don't- but maybe that's not a good idea. I don't know if that's a good idea or not. Like, do I- do I need my auto attack? I'm not- I'm not really sure if I do. I'm just mainly pressing Solar Rider right now.
Wait, which one? Which one is the game you guys are playing right now? Which link is it? Wayne, is that true? Sorry, what'd you say? I didn't hear you. Oh shit! Oh, I said, uh, is it true that Cheese beats you in chess all the time? All the time? Um, yeah. I mean, we played like. For like an hour and then he beat me so i mean in, uh, technically all the times we play he beat me except once hmm. but we don't really play on much at all so Are you guys playing right now? Yeah. Oh, how? How can I view you guys? You want to stream it? Oh, um, you can now. You can just give Van the link. Yeah, the just, game you're just, playing. Just give me the link. Uh, I don't think... I'll send it. Arena Q is still a scam? Hey, welcome back. I'm still doing 15 versus 15 Qs. Have you been in Q this entire time? Or have you actually done a few fights already? Yeah, I am. I'm watching you guys. And I'm not killing in again. I missed the queue. You guys are playing chess? What's what what link are you guys playing chess then? They're playing the the, the kids game, tic tac toe. Wait, you're not playing chess, you're playing tic tac toe? Wait, did wait, did Tony really lose a tic tac toe? Yeah. Damn. It was very unfortunate. And you got lucky. Damn. I guess you don't know the um the strategy for tic tac toe. No, I know, I know. The thing is we've been going even for like six hundred matches, so I wanted to change it up. But then I lost. For six hundred matches? Wait, you guys already played six hundred yeah. games? Yeah, I mean, like... <laughs> yeah. Okay, but seriously, why don't you guys just play chess? I don't know, I think it's too difficult for him. Like, tic-tac-toe is just a draw. Uh, like, there's no, way around, there's no way around it. Unless the other person messes up. Like, yeah. like what you did with uh, mm -hmm. being too drunk or something. <laughs> <laughs> Like, let's, let's play chess. At least there's um, there's actual outplay there. Hmm. And actually, you can actually change things up in chess and make it interesting. Every game is different because there's so many variations. That's true. What if I do this? No. Yeah.
Damn, we're at six minute now. Six minute cues. So, both duel and arena ends at one a.m. So it's not like okay, I can Let's do see. the uh, fifteen versus fifteen now and then search the arena when it closes. They both close at the same time. Oh fuck! Oh my oh, god! Oh shit! I messed that up again. I don't believe this shit. I've died more in safe zone than I died in PvP or PvE so far doing quests. There's no desync or CC resistant chess. Maybe we should just play chess. True, but it's only a one v one game. Actually, there is. There is four player chess. You can do 2v2 in chess or 1v1 in chess if you want to. So maybe you two should play chess. Wing is best SMO player? What does that mean? Wait, what are you guys talking about right now? Who was the best PW player OAT of all time? Isn't it, uh, isn't it Z Flash X? Isn't Marco Z Flash X the best PW player of all time? You never played against Z Flash X? Damn. But see, he has to be the best because he is beating people while on uh, Australian ping. He's an, he's an Australian player. But he beats people who play who's who's playing from EU or NA. Boy, at ping disadvantage. So he has to be the best, right? That cringe lord only played EP though. <laughs> you 3 0 tic tac toe. <laughs> Damn. What the heck? I got. Wait, I'm being wrecked by the summon. I'm being wrecked by a spirit animal. Honestly, losing a tic tac toe is. Uh... You, you hate to see it. What the heck was that? That did so much damage. Occupying. Ch chase the state of outer's bad time to clown Tony and take that though. <laughs> What is this guy doing? I have less HP than him. Why is he running away? Damn. What do you. What the heck is that? Here, guys, I can't hear you guys trash talk me. 
I don't know. What? You guys are playing tic tac toe, man. Play a real game like chess. This guy is went to ice mode. He's too focused. Oh, I got it. There we go. Who's too focused? Oh, I guess you guys are talking over there. No, to 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 Tony was asking you, what do you think of Elion's music? Oh, I'm not, I, I have to mute it because they were playing a different game. Oh. But Elion's PvP? Um... Like, I, like, I mean, like I was saying, conceptually, I think it could be good, but I don't like how it is right now, there's just too many, the support classes are just way too good right now. Okay. Like one warlord negates 10 people easily, and mystic heal. Goes from uh, killing some of you almost them dying to immediately killing them, or immediately killing them back to full. Like it's just the support classes are just way too strong now. They are right now. Like fix that, and I think Eldian could actually pretty be pretty good. But I also don't like how in Eldian there's like a huge emphasis of um. Having to PvP PvE in order to PvP. Damn, this class is so big they can attack while in stealth. They don't they don't leave stealth when doing that. Damn, I guess. Wayne might really go Reaper. Yeah, but I don't I don't I don't really like abusing stealth either though. I'm not really a stealth player. What is what is this? Oh nice hit. Kill him. Damn, not last hitting, yo. I don't think it can be. We we didn't even make the late games. So nobody was talking around with blue forty eight. But apparently, Koyoza said that he wasn't like having any problems killing people. So who knows Me? what's up with that? Yeah, you said you were not having any problems killing people on Elion, right? No, not one v one. I wasn't. People don't know how to counter stealth. Is there like a like you can knock them out of stealth or what? But see, it looks like they can just stay in stealth right now to while attacking, unless I'm mistaken. Usually in games, like when you hit them, they're immediately forced out of stealth.
Summoner has an AoE that will knock them out, and any hard CC will knock them out. Oh, okay. So you have to CC them. You can't. You don't just damage them. Okay, I see. Oops. Damn. Just immediately being attacked. Connect 4 isn't balanced. <gasps> Damn, they're they're playing Connect 4 now? Yep. When are when are they gonna move on to chess? Oh chess is too high level difficulty for them. <laughs> I got him. Got him with the stun. Damn, it's over already. At least I I'm mean, going positive now. It's like nine minutes PvP. That's that's really long wait. How is that long though? It's like seven minute queue, nine minute PvP. I'm queuing almost as long as I am PvPing. Yeah. Like we we need more people in the beta. So the queue time is shorter. Mm -hmm. I thought you guys were doing the one v one, isn't that like better match? Matching? No. There's no 1v1 matching. It's 3v3. It's only 3v3 like, matchmaking. Or the 3v3, should I say then? Yeah, 2 minute queue time, 35 minute PvP. Or just like, you know, have like 1 second queue time. 1 minute PvP is fine too. Like on Swordsman. On Swordsman, they, they implemented the matchmaking when the game was dead. It was so cack. <laughs> yeah. Imagine if they had matchmaking right from the start. Like on this game. No top player one in one minute on Swordsman? Wait, let me check something. Are you sure? <clears throat> I mean... I'm talking. I'm saying like one. Like if you do a single round, maybe it's possible. Like it's a twenty minutes. You get you get two hundred. You get two hundred seconds right from the start, right? So if they win in one minute, they have to win before the time reaches one forty. But then there's like, but then you can do like an infinite combo with some classes. Hmm. Watch the chess 1v1. Wait, what do you mean? I I knew you weren't Asian. Oh, yeah, it's Chase. He said he's white. Okay.
Hold up. I think in this Ooh. in this match didn't isn't this match who's black and white how, how fast was this match it's still pretty early it's been like two minutes I th I think I I think I I won this game in under before with the Hiram hit 140. Damn. Why are you doing twisty like this? <laughs> did I? I <laughs> I thought I did. Let me just double check. Damn. Twizzy. <laughs> Wayne's, Wayne's beating your ass, bro. Oh, 151. 151. Damn. <laughs> Twizzy is best splendid. How do I be in under one minute? I don't know. I guess he must have beaten me in 30 seconds then. That's the that's the only explanation. So there's still a huge difference, you know? 30 seconds versus one minute. I feel like... Damn. What do you mean? You, you, you never beat me. We fight two games, I beat you in two games. And we're still in queue. Fight when the queues. I'm about to queue for a 3v3 instead. Damn, when's going for 3v3? Also, the chess 1v1. You guys were already winning in chess. Oh, you can kill both, both BG and Arena? Maybe you should do that. Is this your chess game? Oh, you can kill both BG and Arena. I didn't know that. Heck. I would assume you can only hit, I would assume you can only kill for one. Oh, it looks like I got the Q. New Mario hit 2k. <laughs> Damn. I guess time for you to uh, smurf. So you can get more fights. <laughs> Maybe time for you to queue for 15 versus 15 instead. You wanna do a territory war? Uh, I guess the best we got is Realm War and Aulia, right? The 100 versus 100 of Realm War. What's the 200 versus 200?
give you my perfect world account? Right, if I oh, was wait, Kate, perfect world account has no gear. I beat Pony like two moves ago. Yeah. Well, it's too late now. I, 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 I don't know, but I was able to process this in my head. Damn, I guess Van was too, is too good. He's processing moves in his head. Two moves ago. You're processing moves that happened two moves ago in your head. What do you mean? <laughs> well, it's hard, eh? Does it matter though? They have G17, yes, yeah, so, and I have no gear on Perfect World. That's what I'm saying. Why do you want my Perfect World account? Yeah, that's why that's why there's no point for me to give you my account. So I might as well keep it for myself so I can uh, keep the legacy. Damn, keep the legacy. Ooh. Yep. Damn, this guy's getting wrecked. Damn, but now he did that. Damn, that guy got wrecked instantly. Do only like did he not have a CC break? Do only I have a CC break or her or what was that about? I assume every class would have some form of CC break, right? They ban your perfect world account for no reason. Damn. They also banned Neil's account though. Wait, why why did Neil get banned? On Perfect World. Neil got banned? On Perfect World, yeah. Damn, so he's got his BDO account and his PWI account banned? Sonic roll. It's on a roll. Damn. Damn, why is this guy immune? Uh, I guess, I guess, what, this is like an immune state? What? No, that was a bad move. What the fuck are you talking about? Fuck, no, now I'm just getting ganked. Fuck. Fuck, where's where's anyone? Where's anyone? Damn. Nah, no, I told t Tony fucked up. You're. I only muted you, Chase. You can still talk to us to Tony. I did. I didn't mute you on on the server. Yeah, you're not server muted, Chase. So what what are you complaining about? Yeah, he was on server muted because I had to mute him yesterday. He's never been server muted. Well, there wasn't there was a uh, server mute or like a, a mute icon besides his thing before that. I didn't put there. I swear there was. Maybe I did. Maybe I was just imagining things. Oh, or is he asking to un me to unmute him? Damn. I'm just out of, I'm out of way out of position now. I couldn't kill that guy. I thought I could like do more damage to him faster. Why did they ban Neil on Perfect World? Cause um Cause like he had some haters and then he made a joke saying he was gonna sell his account. And then his haters uh, screenshot it and sent it to the GM and he got perma ban. That. You, even though it's pretty obvious if you're like trying to sell your account, you wouldn't like do it in the world chat. I feel like my FPS is getting lower now. What's going on? <laughs> I, I had like 60. Now I'm at like 38. Is this same memory leaking or something?
I don't even know how I how I did, I did so much more damage on that one. It won't ban your account for racism, but saying don't sell, sell your account, yeah. Because you know, if people sell their account, that affects their income. You know, being racist doesn't, I guess. This guy out here by himself. Outplayed. I didn't, I outplayed him. That was a classic case of outplay. Let me heal up. Why is my FPS dropping anyways? Yeah, I'm not even going above like 60 now. Maybe there's memory leakage. Yeah. I'm gonna reload, restart the game after this one maybe. Tony, are, 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 you, are you on a new game? Meditate for H3 in PvP as well. Yeah, on chest. Fuck! I fell in a crack. And let him Damn. get away. Yeah, I was trying to chase him, like, and knock him backwards or something. Environmental. Environmental hazard. Yep. <laughs> got him. I got him. I I feel like. Hmm. I feel like other classes don't have CC breaks. I'm not sure if that's true or not. I'm best berserker and they know I'm not. No one's best berserker and they man. Come on. Now we already have best players. Is this ain't me? I finish him off with this. I finish them off, and we win. They do. You does anyway. Okay. I just wasn't sure, like, cause like earlier, as soon as the game started, I this guy got CC for five seconds, and he just tanked, and he just like took all the hits, and then just died instantly. He didn't even try to break out of CC. I wasn't sure if he didn't have a CC break 
Or if he just doesn't know that he could CC, right? Okay, I'm gonna I, I'm gonna restart the game real quick because I don't know if I'm memory leaking or what. Because I'm pretty sure I'm getting less FPS now. I had higher FPS earlier, so let me just do a quick restart. One sec. Oh, Spellsword has two CC breaks. Nice. Hmm. I closed the game, but it still says I'm in game. What's up with that? Okay, wait, now, now it's fine. All right, restarting now. We have evasion skill. Okay, yeah, I have like a double CC break as well. Oh, it's like one CC break, but I can use it twice. I'm not sure if that's something common to every class, though. I guess maybe I have to make a character for every class and find out. Also, hey, Sir Sensei, welcome to the stream. See, I'm now like 94 FPS now. My FPS was definitely getting lower over time for some reason. Who is the best Reaper in A? Actually, where do you see the rankings? Where do you even access the ranking anyway? The leaderboard. It can't be this, right? Like this is, I don't actually know what this is. This is Battle Squad. This is cross platform. Rankings are calculated based on Battle Squad points on the cross platform servers. In case of a tie, perhaps it's going to play for each their score first. In Battle Squads, you have to need a cultivator that reads first floor of Hado. Each team will have earned 10 victory or 20 duels can receive dual gear with fortune level of plus 50, plus 5. Rewards such as actions and color for accolades are awarded at the end of season, according to Battle Squad ranking. I don't know what this is. Is this for 5v5, I'm assuming? We don't even have 5v5 right now, do we? At least I'm not seeing it. This is 15 versus 15, this is 10 versus 10. Actually, wait, why is 10 versus 10 not on un not unlocked for me? How do I unlock it? Maybe it will be available tomorrow. No, because it says daily from 10 a.m. to 1 a.m. So Right now, it's we're in the queue time for 10v10 as well. But it says it's not unlocked. What does that mean? Maybe I haven't done my cultivation? Check, yeah, I checked your cultivation. Unlocked on Unlocks level a 50? 50? But wait, but we can't even get 50. I'm at max. I'm at the highest level XP. Why is that level 37? Oh, you're memeing, okay. Bruh. Good meme. No, you should be able to unlock it. That's weird. Uh, 
Like, what is there? I reached the highest cultivation level as well. Well, it's it's level thirty seven in the beta, but like when it's open beta. Well, no, like... I'm I'm student playing one. I'm level one actually, not level thirty seven. All right, there. That was student one. Wait, there's also Land of Emerald Cloud. Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Oh, but you need a team of five to do this. I don't have a team of five. This van is too slow. What are you talking about? They're still not able to PvP. What? And, um... So I'm just trying to figure out then... How to unlock this, because I'm not seeing anything that says... Wait, go... go I can unlock... How to unlock the Ford Heizo. Go to... Event calendar? May maybe it'll show the date. Event calendar? You think it's a weekly event, maybe? Yeah. I don't see it. I mean, technically, max level on BDO, at least the soft cap right now is like 62. That's a weird number, too. Or 63. Both are pretty weird numbers. Yeah, no, I only have the Chang'an Arena and the Duel. That's it. And the Battle of the Continent. I'm not seeing anything. You're too old Tony in chess. I guess Van is next. Or is Dante next? Didn't Dante say he wanted to uh, play chess? there's no desync and no CC resist. 37 is way weirder than 62. <laughs> Debatable, but maybe. What are you talking about? But technically it's level 1. Level 1 isn't weird. It's just that I have to get to level 36 before I can be level 1. That's that's how they count in this game. gonna try Lost Ark with you. I already, well, I already tried Lost Ark. And it's good. We're just waiting for it to come to NA now. So... That's not really the issue right now. And there's so many people here right now. I think I'm just gonna dip. <laughs> and attack a different place. Unmute one sec. I'm in a, I'm in uh in combat. Oh, I can get him real quick. Or not? He's just healed back to full. Oh my god. God damn it. Wait, how did I get a kill? <gasps> what was that? I just randomly got a kill.
And meanwhile, that guy who I targeted, I didn't get a kill on him. Get him. Damn, no kill. And then I somehow I got him. I got a kill on him. Damn, what the fuck? I'll, I'll unmute doing? him when I die. All right. You're stealing kills. I know. I'm. I'm getting kills on people who I'm not even trying to kill. But on people who I'm trying to kill, I'm not getting anything. This is. Such a yeah, level. I got the kill on him. Wow. I guess this is why Dante keeps saying I'll be good at League of Legends. Good at last sitting, you know. But not really. Because I only last sit people who I'm not targeting. Damn, I can't believe how many people spend money on fashion already. I don't think race has anything to do with it. So uh, what's your question? Yeah. Correct. Oh. I don't know how I did so much damage to him all of a sudden. Maybe because of my stacks. I keep pressing 4 by accident. They lose the fashion, but they gain back the currency they have, plus 20%. Yeah. So They're still they... done. I don't really want to deal with that. Yeah. You spent 3,000 points, right? So, when it's open beta, they'll give you back 3,000 points back, but they'll give you like 500. It's, it's, it's like, yeah, I don't know. Alright, maybe I can get him. Well, like, we don't know how right, I got him. will be in the future, right? Try to target down the people with less HP. Oh. So. So, what if the game just die down and then just, you know? Alright, get the stun on him? Wait, he stunned me. I mean, this game, according to Steam chart, is about, it has about 7,000 players. So, and that's only the Steam. We, I, I, I don't know about... Maybe the, I can get him? Alright. Got them real quick. Who else is slow? Finish those people off first. Damn, I guess Wayne's finishing off people with only low HP. <laughs> <laughs> That's the strat. Yeah. That's the strat for the KDA ratio. Well, it's also good because what's the point of doing a bunch of damage if no one dies? Wait, that guy's a skill back to full instantly. Damn. Such replay. Why is he not take Wait, how did that how does that work? What's this happen? He was like full HP and then he instantly went to zero. Is that the skill of his? That's a good question. Nah, I am former StarCraft player, which means I'll be one of the greatest ever. But I was only Masters in StarCraft, not even Grandmaster. It could be lag because... And I, I only I... got Masters in StarCraft by uh, using two base all in every game. <laughs> because I, I I heard a lot of Australian and C server is playing on 8 and on A. Oh, you think it's because of lag? Yeah, because a lot of C players... And EG players playing on any server because there's a lot of EG servers as you can see. Oh, but if it's but like this isn't BDO though. Like if they're lagging, I sh I should still see them normally, right? Like they shouldn't be lag. They should be lagging for themselves, but not for me. Well, they, they didn't. 
Yes. True, but, but at, at least like you didn't see like a big decent right like they'll just stand there and then they'll just die yeah that's what i'm getting that's what i'm wondering though like they should like i shouldn't see them standing there like i should also see them not dead on my screen bars are immortal what the fuck Bars are actually immortal. I just get Damn, him. Damn, you got the kill. What yeah, the I, I, I just had to get him real quick while I was running away. <laughs> Maybe I can get him as well while I'm here. Alright, go for it. This is, this is, this is a bard, right? Fucking hell. Bro, they're actually immortal. Yeah, that's embarrassing. I need to like one combo them with a zero to death. Well, he can't. All, all the skill level is like one. Is it worth it going for the bar? Like, they just gotta run away and heal. I got a zero to death them. KDA? I guess this is my best KDA because I, I got an infinite KDA. Ooh, eight zero. Ooh. I got infinity KDA. Damn. Wayne has eight viewers and he got eight kills. That's zero death. What, do, what does that have to do with anything? It's not like I'm killing my viewers. This is le these are legit kills. Wayne, uh, un uh, uh, unmute Tony. They're not Please. feeding. They're not feeding me. All right. All right. What's up, Tony? I, I unmuted you. Oh yeah, I was gonna ask like, no, I was gonna say, uh, there's like people with ten viewers giving away keys. So, can't you just apply for like uh, an affiliate thing with Solo? Damn. You think they're gonna give me affiliate on solo Maybe. when I'm not even affiliate with Twitch? <laughs> sure, sure. I, I think they will. Maybe just apply just randomly, so you can just give the, give out the keys to like you know people in the Discord. <laughs> <laughs> well, to be an affiliate with Twitch, I need 50 followers and I need an average of three viewers. I don't think I don't even have that. Really? Want, no. Mm. I, don't, I wonder if they're gonna like accept me. Let I have me, like 20 followers. Give me a sec. They're gonna sleep because I, uh, I muted you? I mean, it's your bedtime right now, anyways, isn't it? I don't think me muting you have anything to do with that. Or did you just I mean, run out of people to have... play in uh, chess? Do I have what? Wait, do you have to be an affiliate, Twitch affiliate to apply for that uh, partnership with Solo? Who knows? Uh, what's the link to apply? No idea. Let me check. Well, I'm just saying, you know. I'm like a smaller streamer than that guy probably was 10 viewers. Mm -hmm. So would they even make me an affiliate? That's the question. But I mean, I guess, yeah, it, does, I guess dude, it doesn't hurt to try. The dude had uh, 130 followers and like eight 
current viewers. Yeah, I'm a small when streamer. He was the key. Wait, I, I, I don't even have uh, 50 followers. But I mean, I mean, I, I mean, I can try. Oh, I guess Chase went back to Brawlhalla. If I promoted my stream, well, yeah, I don't, sure. I don't stream enough to promote it. I think, like, if I become a. Like, if I do streams on the regular, like, maybe X amount of time per week, then I think it would be justifiable to promote it. But right now, I'm pr only streaming uh, for the four days for solo. So I don't know if it really makes sense for me to promote it, because I could promote it on my YouTube channel, I guess, if I wanted to. But I just don't want to be, like, promote something only for it to be nothing you know, if, if i promote something i feel like it has to be something that's a i feel is actually good oh, it has to be good for wayne like if i'm not proud of it then i don't feel like i can promote it Wait, why is my FPS dropping again? I feel like I, when I tab out, my FPS went lower. Damn, what the heck? I can't even get out of that. I saw it. I, 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 you, you got sucked in, I think, or something. I don't yeah, know. I couldn't get out of that. Maybe because I already used my two, two CC breaks. I think that's a CC, maybe? I, I, I think I can actually break out of that if I save my CC break. But that's just like an instant. This is instant damage. Wait, what? I did not counter him. Didn't get the kill there. Alright, I just need fire. Okay, no, we just need wood. Oh, they're dropping. Fucking chase. <laughs> get him. Damn, we're not getting I didn't get the kill. Fuck! He really, he really snuck up. He really got the sneak capture. What? How did he heal? He was almost dead. Come on. Die already. Oh my god, he's, he's just self healing my DPS now.
Maybe now? There we go. We're just we're gonna lose this now because they got the point and they can respawn here. Where did he go? Oh, he's right there. What the heck? What the heck? He did like 42k in one skill. But he, I didn't get CC this time. It wasn't like the grab skill this time. One skill? That's crazy. It has to be like some sort of OT then. I'm sort of ulti. I I I never see you use V. I don't know how V works. It's like a uh, execution skill. Yeah, but it doesn't like I I never get it though. Like I don't know what the condition is to get it. I I was able to get it when I was killing moths, but. Yeah, the, the description is really bad. I I also don't know how to get it. Yeah. Damn. Are you really going to keep chasing? <laughs> yep. <laughs> it's revenge when they sh when they chase me. That bar, I swear they just gonna keep healing. Nope, we got him. Oh. It's revenge. Got him. It's revenge. Huge. But now, but now I have to go and get uh, water and wood. I guess I'll just go this way. Turn this sneak through the other through the uh, back. I think this way leads to Earth, right? So I have to sneak from up there. Hey, Tony. Weren't you gonna give me yes. the affiliate link? Oh, no. Wait. Give me a sec. Oh, is this the 1v1? I mean, I thought there was an affiliate link based on like, you know, there was like a lot of streamers giving out the keys. So I just assumed that, you know, people were applying somewhere, but I can't find it. I mean, it's not a bad assumption. Oh, come on, Wayne. You can do this. Get the kill. Let me see. Did I get the kill? No, I don't get the kill. Damn. I, I just don't. I don't get the kill. Damn, bro. The I just, I just get, I just get chipped to death. Need, need to learn how to use that execution skill. I don't know if the execution skill is even a PvP skill or if that's a PvE only skill.
Okay, so I joined the solo Discord server. Do you want me to? I should ask the community manager. Ask them for what? Like how how do these uh, the people get the beta keys and stuff like that? Oh, people just been giving them out. Yeah, but how? how? Do they buy them? Uh, I don't think you can buy them because when I bought, when I pre-ordered the game, um, it only gave me four keys, which I already gave oh. to you guys. Oh, okay. So maybe that's why people were giving them away because they, they had extra keys. But then it's like, why would you buy the games just to like get four keys? You know? I don't know. Maybe to like promote their stream and stuff like that. Do you give away way more than four keys? I don't think so. So there was this one streamer who would do uh, a giveaway every mm -hmm. like one or two hours, but it would just be like one key. Uh huh. How many did he give away in total? I think it was two that I remember. So po po possibly four uh, in total. Well, either way, even if I am an affiliate, like they will have to be okay with me giving out the key to whoever I want, you know? They, maybe they have some rules, or right? it has to be us through a fair draw. So you have to respect that as well. So it's not like <laughs> me being an affiliate, it's just an automatic answer to you getting a key. True. Sure. But you know, if you pre ordered for $40, you're, you're, you can uh, get into the beta right now. I'm not that interested to be honest in this game anymore. I would have been if it had like 1v1s. Hmm. I guess more of a 1v1 player than 3v3 player. Yeah. Well, it is what it is, I guess. But you can still duel people, you know? Go yeah, into the city, true. ask you to duel. <laughs> Oh, really? You can ask for duels? Yeah, you can ask for duels, of course. Why not? That's cool. I mean, as a you can ask for duels. It's just that there's like no... Like, you don't have rooms. Like, you have to just duel on the spot. Oh, yeah. Eldeon, you couldn't. Yeah, I don't know. Eldeon... Eldeon made a really weird decision to not have duels. Like, almost every game have duels. Even games that are... Not PvP oriented have duels. So we only have one more hour of PvP today. Because it closes, because the PvP closes in one hour, I guess. Better make the most of it. Yeah. So if you're not in like the time zone, then you're kind of fucked. Auto minus two, but that's only for queuing, though. Like... I guess later on, when they have open world, I'm assuming you can go in open world whenever. So maybe it's not that bad when they have that. Who knows?
And besides, helps you fix our sleep schedule, you know? <laughs> Forces you to sleep at the correct time. Damn, bro, man. That guy's down. Now it's time to run away. Come back. Alright, counter him. What? What was that? Fuck! He didn't die. Well, you don't have to sleep. You just can't PvP, you know? Well, you just can't Q. Because that's the, that's when they assume, like... This way? You... Like, I guess they're kind of assuming the game won't be... Like, we'll have people who are trying to, like, cheese. And, uh, win trade. So, like, this way, by making it so that you can only Q during the times when most people are playing, reduces the possibility of them win trading, I guess. I guess, I think that's, like, kind of their line of thinking. What the heck? Wait, how did I even... Like, just suddenly, just like that, like, it didn't even... Like, I just lost all my HP. For, like, almost nothing. Like, they, they, that's definitely a thing. Like, it, the animations don't feel impactful at all. It did not at all felt like... I was gonna die there, but then I did. I think that's one thing that can definitely be improved on. Check Discord, what? Check. I guess he triggered auto mod. Gotta be careful of what you're saying. You made three followers? Congrats. It's just memes calm down, Twitch. Check. Twitch is a professional website. You have to be professional here. I wasn't even sure who was attacking me there. Damn, 
I'm getting wrecked this game. What the heck? Knocked down again. Can I get him? Oh, where did he go? Did he die? Just disappeared. Yo, Wayne. Yeah? Uh, I think I'm gonna go sleep. Alright, good night, man. Good night, good night. Good night, guys. See you tomorrow. Bye. Get him? Okay, he died somehow, I don't even know. I didn't kill him, though. Now this guy's a Sinted, I think. Let's finish him off. Damn, that guy's not taking any damage. What? Wait, he still killed me, even though I was blocking. Huh? Some skills can't be blocked? Or what's this happen? But I was blocking, though. Against that guy, I suddenly did a whole bunch of damage. Damn, I got wrecked that round. I guess I'll try queuing for some uh, duels now, since we're almost approaching the end of the night before PvP is over.
in 50 minutes. But damn, why does it take like a whole minute before you get in, before it starts? Make sure the queue is fast, but there's like a whole one minute cooldown or countdown. Does it really need to count down for a whole minute? this guy finish him off yeah, all right got him off I'm low now I think it's just this one guy now no way there's two guys you have to be careful all right got him just done okay we got him Just in time for me to ban the bot. Perfect timing. Damn it, did so much damage that round. I still don't know how there was this one round where some guy came in and instantly did like 24k damage though. Ended in like 10 seconds. Just wiped all three of them. Damn, I guess Tony missed me missed me doing 3v3 though. He left before I got to do 3v3s. Guy now, CC them. Damn, that guy went full stealth. Let's target. Target this guy.
What? This really came down to 1v1. I think my teammate even die. I didn't even see them die. Best Berserker in NA? What? Best Bronze League player, I guess. Just I guess technically. I am uh the best bronze one player. Because I'm not bronze one anymore. I'm bronze two now. And in fact, I'm, I'm also the best bronze too, because one more round and I'll be bronze three. <laughs> That's about it. Damn, one minute queue now. We need more people playing. I hope they give them more keys for close beta too. bronze and I already had like two minutes for queuing. This is why we need 1v1 queues. I guess just do what he said. What uh I think I said it and, and queue for both at the same time. And see which one I get in. Oh looks like it's dual. I haven't been getting another jade. I'm trying to upgrade my jade so I can put it in to my bag. But I'm not sure how to get another one. Hmm. I'm reducing coming down to a 30% in here. Interesting. How did he do 20k as soon as the game started? The fuck? Like I was on that guy and those two were already dead and he did 20k. I don't get how that works.
那那家究竟是什么来头？竟敢接连进犯太华山与白草府？听师傅说，他出身东海的阴魂，夫君便是被镇压在秘境中的大妖皇女。All right, so I was looking at this, right? I can either get mastery or sprint. Mastery and sprint, or physical strength and perception. Like physical strength increases more damage, but mastery increases the damage of specific skills. And sprint increases reduces cooldown. So maybe that's actually good. Like should I go for cooldown reduction when I'm gearing up instead? Like actually, maybe I should go for. More mastery, more sprint. It's the physical strength and perception. But some of my cooldowns are so long. Like Forty-five seconds here. Or can this one not be reduced? Because I noticed that this one is like in green, whereas this one is in white. So maybe some of them can't be reduced. In eight minutes? No, it ends at one a.m. So we got like another half an hour as well. It's not the same minutes. Wait, why are we not queuing in? I press confirm. Damn, it's just like a 60 second countdown. Is that really necessary? Do you really need a 60 second countdown? This is bug. going up. Damn, what is this strat? What? Wait, what? Wait, what the heck? What was that? I don't get it though. It said it said to like tap the right A and D to get out the CC, but then I will CC the entire time. What? What happened? But he says focus the bard. But which one is the bard? What does the bard symbol look like? Wait, which chat do I even which chat do I even go in to talk to him? 
I don't even know which chat to go to, to go to talk to, to reply to him. I, I still don't know which one was the bard. Which one was the bard? No, oh, but seriously, which one is the bard? I, it doesn't tell you when I must mouse over the symbols. Usually games tell you, when you mouse over the class symbol, what the class is. The fuck? I'm supposed to figure this out. But that's for Slayer. That's for General? What's a General? Spearmaster? That's for Summoner? So that guy is the Slayer. But what's the other two? You're going to be kidding me. Okay, I see him now. Oh, he's a spell spell sword from Spirit Master. What, what is this strategy? What is that strategy? Blocks also doesn't work sometimes. Like, sometimes my block will knock them down when they hit me, but sometimes it doesn't do anything. That I'm not sure about either. Hmm. It almost bedtime when PvP end at 1 a.m. Yep, I guess after 1 a.m. It's time to, uh become a chess player instead.
Bard icon looks like a flower. But that was a summoner last time when we had a flower on our team. See, no, this is a bard, and that does not look like a flower. That looks like a fire, actually. This is like a flame. Look at the guy, the clown face guy. What the heck? What is this? That's the damage bard? There's a healing bard and the damage bard? I thought he was like a spell sword with how many like ranged attacks he had. But that's a bard. That was like a that's like a fucking caster. That's like an elementalist on Elion. That guy. Actually, I need to be right back. I will, I will be right back. Give me a sec.
No, it's just generally five minutes, but I could also be back earlier, you know? But you know what they say, it's better to be early than it is to be late. Better to set a long timer and then make it back early than to set a short timer and be late. <laughs> um, but yeah. I just realized that it's been seven hours and I haven't uh, went to get water yet. So, I guess good PvP. Pretty much only drank one bottle of water since seven hours ago. So who knows, maybe the PvP in this game will be good after all, compared to Elyon. are long. I'm not getting to user queue. Oh, right now. Guess I missed missed the queues when everyone was queuing up. And only like another 20 minutes now remaining before PvP is over. Oops, I forgot to switch the scene. There we go, there we go. Fix now, everything should be good. Yeah, everything's good now. So... Sprint actually also increases my edge regeneration. Which means I can use this more often. Hmm. Or should I just go the normal route and just get more damage? I have this one, and I guess I can also get this one. Hmm. Actually, I don't really... Wait, should I get more sprint? So wait, if I choose this, I actually I get more sprint. But if I choose this, I actually lose Sprint for more Mastery. How come the Clouds slash Herb gives Sprint compared to the Xueji Herbs? Whereas the Cloud slash Wine does not give Sprint compared to the Xueji Wine. Hmm, that's really weird. I would have thought like these are two different sets. Like one is more oriented towards Sprint and one's more oriented towards uh. Perception, but it doesn't look like it. No water in eight hours. Nah, game was just too good. I just forgot. PvP in this game is too good. What can I say? I guess this is the game to play. Berserker is furry class. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, there was this one quest where you have a girl right on your back when you're in wolf form. So. 
How am I memeing so hard right now? <laughs> what do you mean? This is not a meme. This is the only real explanation. How else do you explain it? That I didn't drink water on purpose? Of course I would drink water. If I remembered it. The game made me forget. I don't know what to tell you, man. Fuck. Alright, got him. Fuck. Damn, I'm low. But I think we're good. Just, it's just him to kill now. Fuck. What the heck? What is that range? Or oh, that's such a long range. I guess I I guess this game actually has really long range of all classes. Being a furry is how you get a GF. Uh... Well... I mean, I guess... If you can transform... Into an animal... That can carry other people... That helps with getting a GF, I suppose. But so would, uh... I don't know. Driving? That does the same thing. But maybe not. Time to buy some some of these items. Cloud slash wolf head. Nah. Oh shit. I can't buy a wolf head. Because I'm not Songs of the Battlefield 2 yet. But I can buy a wine. I guess I can buy a wine, but I can't buy a wolf head. <laughs> that makes a lot of sense. I still don't really know what these things are. They're just artifacts or relics. But how do you, how, like, how are you equipping a wolf head, a glass of wine, and herbs on your character right now? Maybe best not to think too much about it.
Oh, shit. I need PvP Steel Stone 2 to enhance these ones. Oh, wait. And they can be enhanced a second time. Damn, these things are OP. They can be enhanced up to plus 3. And I need PvP Steel Stone 2. Wait, but why do I already need Steel Stone 2? I thought Steel Stone 1 was good up to 79. And these are only 60. But I really need Steel Stone 2 to enhance these. Damn, what is going on? What is my win rate? Why do I figure that out? How can you have bad numerical translation though? That makes no sense. Like it's just numbers. What? In, how can you translate like like 60 to 80 in any language? I know, how do you mistranslate that? Like that's physically impossible. Even a beginner translator cannot, how can, like it's just numbers. You don't need to translate these, just type it as is. <laughs> like you see 55, you just type 55. How it, you, you cannot, it's impossible to mistranslate because there's no translation needed. Seven is pretty close to five. <laughs> what are you talking about? The thing is, you don't even need to translate it. It's it's just as is. You just copy and paste it without changing a thing. Check in box. Got some heartstrings. Got some PV stone. Got some reversal bell. Reset the calendar check in. Wait, what reward am I getting for doing a PVE right now? Or doing duels right now? My money's not increasing now. No, but I need money. So I can, uh, and I, I need a way to get jades. Where can I get some jades? I need to socket my, uh... I need to sock out my wine glass and herb, herb bag with a level 2 red jade. Where do I get that from?
Damn, there's account stash and it's free. I guess better game than Perfect World. Art string trader. Damn, I can uh, befriend Van now. Not sure what that does though. But too bad Van is uh, low level and can't PvP. Oh, I actually queued into a uh, 15 versus 15 instead of a duel. That's surprising. You would expect the duel would be shorter queue. Yeah, I'm in close beta 1. In close beta 2, I guess uh, I will have to reroll to a different character to give you time to catch up. Or you can just turn on speed hack. Just enable your speed hack, man. And uh, PvP tomorrow. Damn, this guy is the best in the Millennium. Here's the here's the best player, Dante, that you're looking for. And also this guy, this is the best bard. And this is the best slayer. These are the best players. What, what are they? What is team threat? What the hell is this? The fuck? Best of all time, not best of millennium. <laughs> oh, you have to be the best of millennium to be the best of all, to be a candidate of best of all time. So. They are the best candidates for being the best of all time right now. Damn, we're about to get zerged. What to do? Die. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? How is this possible? Why is this guy so tanky?
God damn it. So, how are some of these people so tanky? Who is healing? This guy? In time to... Uh. Damn! Damn, these people don't die! That's not even close. I'm gonna get fire. What the hell? What is going on? But what is what is this skill where he's just on top of me? Like like how how does he just go on top of me? What are these skills? And then this time we already got fire, so now I need to go to water and iron. Wait, what? Why can't that not be blocked? Wait, why couldn't that attack be blocked though? Like I was trying to block it to counter, but it just kept saying can't be blocked. I guess I heal up. But this block is sucks though. Like sometimes it knocks them down, sometimes it doesn't. I don't get how it works. It's not anything like it's not like SMO block at all. Oh wait, where did God Iron? I guess now I have to get uh wood and water. In that time. Oh. Oh, I can't get that to get a shield. I have to flank. I have to make a comeback here. Oh shit, they just got everything, how? They got all five. 
I guess time to go for this one now. Down here. Damn, we're losing. We're hard losing. All right, now we need to get a uh, fire. Fuck earth. We don't need earth. Fuck this invisible wall. That's so awkward. You should like it feels like you should definitely be able to go through that. If you're not gonna let people go through it, why design it that way? Oh damn, we got Earth actually. But I think we're gonna lose still. They're just too far ahead. We have four. And now I can't and now we get all five, so we can pause their game completely. But they got iron back. Or they got water back. So I think we're losing we're just gonna lose anyways. Yeah, there's like no one defending. Everyone's just at Earth. So we're just fucked. Yeah, we're just fucked. I to get this guy. Damn. But see, you don't really get reward. Wait, actually, no, this is the elemental cave point. So I'm top for elemental caves. So I'm top for capturing points, actually. But people don't really look at that. So no more queues now, I'm guessing. Yeah, no more queues now. Damn. Damn. Well, I guess that's it for today's stream, then. Unfortunate. But it is, it is the end, I guess. We are at the end of the dual time. And we're at the end of PvP. And we're also at the end of the stream. I guess it's time to log off. Alright, good night, everyone. Yep, unfortunate. PvP is over. No more PvP. No more stream. Oh, good night, guys. Thanks for watching. I guess uh, I'll come back for PvP tomorrow instead. But take care, all.